everyone else is ready to switch. I'm starting here. Mm-hmm, okay. mm-hmm. I'm not that bestie. I'm in my starting screen. I'll make a good old tweet. I can't wait to switch from my starting screen to the actual screen I want and see everything break before I even realize it. Oh, I love it when stuff breaks. That's what I live for. I have to make sure my mic setup is correct. It is, luckily. I just hear rapid. That's, that's, that's the mechanical keyboard, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Which I I turned up noise suppression to block it out specifically, and it doesn't work. <laughs> it doesn't no. work. We can still. <laughs> I've had someone I knew who would just join calls, not say a single word, but we always knew he was there because his keyboard was constantly fucking going off. He's all here. You're not a true Discord user if you don't have mechanical keyboard sounds by at least one person in your call. I I, I have my yeah I have, do I have noise suppression on? Yeah, I've got noise suppression on. You can't really hear my keyboard keys for some reason. Hang on, I'll, I'll go I, crazy. Hang on. I use the headset mic because I need to go buy an actual mic still. I think, so I think it's because my microphone, my microphone is kind of like hovering like right by the keyboard, but like I, there's nowhere yeah. else for me to put it. <laughs> That's fair. I don't know, so like, I don't know how I'm gonna set it up when I finally like have my model working because my setup is like, I'm on like an L-shaped desk and I don't know how I could move everything <laughs> so I could still like be visible from from my oh, art angle and my win. gaming angle. <laughs> I just kind of put things in spot where I have space and hope it works. That's probably what I'm going to end up doing. A lot of times it doesn't. <laughs> Yana, are you in the chat? Yeah. Why are you in the chat? Why aren't you in the chat? I am in the chat. I'm chatting Wait, with someone right now. Which chat? What chat, chat are we talking about? My your chat. chat. Oh, I gotta open your chat. Because <laughs> you go to the YouTubes, right? I do YouTube videos. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where are you? Boom. I only do YouTubes. I actually have changed. Oh, I can hear your stream to it. I changed your uh, my um my uh, YouTube brand branding to be over to something that's not my actual name, so I can say stuff. Hi, it's me. I'm typing. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Poorly, I can see that. <sighs> Why do people watching? We're not even starting yet. <laughs> this is starting soon. Yeah. Get out of my chat, people. <laughs> no, you talk to my people. I don't need to talk to you guys. Wow. <laughs> Harsh. I'm already talking to you guys. I don't need to talk to you guys in the chat as well. <laughs> Oh, yeah. I can't. I maybe, can't stand you. Maybe I just need a lot of attention. <laughs> <laughs> maybe that's why I'm a streamer in the first place. I just need an inordinate amount of attention all the time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm exercising my rights as DM to uh, post memes in chat. Oh. I don't actually have memes, unfortunately. Me neither. It's okay. Open anymore. 
I'm just gonna stay on the starting because <laughs> nobody's there. You can't see everyone. It's mm -hmm. only on. You only see my ears, and that's it. <laughs> that's all we need. Just to I can see. Me. I can see your comments, which means I can see myself show up on screen, and that's all I need. Of course. Oh, voice <laughs> mods, fucking. Oh. Ah. Oh, what the hell <laughs> Sorry. was that? What the fuck was that? It works. <laughs> Sorry, that was my um, that was my sensor bleep. Is that your sensor button? Yeah. <laughs> I need clicked it on accident. Probably. I can. <laughs> Why do you have a sensor button? It's on voice mod. It just comes with voice mod. <laughs> oh. I should get voice mod. It's really I good. I I, I have tons of effects. I can do I can do a rim shot. Oh no. <laughs> I like that. that was I think good the, the favorite one that you've used so far when I've been I in the closet with you was the. Uh, oh, yeah, the. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I love it. <laughs> also, uh, my new favorite right now is. <laughs> I like that one. Isn't that just a, so, the bonk sound? I'm yeah. Being mean in chat today. Why are you going to be so mean? Are we ready to okay, start? First of all, to oh, yeah. are we ready to start? Uh, I'm ready to start. I have been ready the yeah. moment I was born. Okay, I'm, so we're going to switch over? Yep. Yeah. Oh, 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 no, oh no, no, everybody was people. viewing my voice mod. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Mean and me don't <laughs> like you guys anymore. <laughs> we? <laughs> oh yeah, I was gonna showcase to the chat or to whoever's watching you's um picture thingy. It's beautiful. Cause I never did show anyone what you look like other than comfy claps. Wait. I just noticed. It says don't tell her what not to do. That means yeah. we can tell you what to do, just as long as they don't tell you not to do something. We're gonna Basically, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna pop her. Above well, with the everyone. right wording, we can tell you to not do things without telling you to not do them by telling you this to do the you. opposite instead. I'm I'm pulling this her up. You. I'm pulling her up on my screen too, so so my yeah, chat can see as well. Yeah, I'm looking at. <laughs> oh. you, you, she is my everything, and I love her. Well, she isn't me, but I love her. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like the secret stuff. To, I was actually supposed to um, rig her as well, or at least rig the outfit for the D&D stuff, but I never had the chance to. Oh, that you would has, be really I fun. have, like, legs exist. You just never see legs. the legs. Legs, legs, legs. Where's your yo? Ah! <laughs> okay, that's enough of you. you. You can go by now. I should just draw a really shitty uh, MS Paint drawing of what I think Ben l would look like and call it good for mine. You have a picture of Ben. I do. I Where? Even Where? make like the actual right appearance here. of my character. I just uh, have a, I mean, a, a vague <laughs> idea. <laughs> I forgot I drew that. <laughs> There's Ben. Ben is right there. Yeah, with his weird flamey hair. Yeah, that's is Ben. That... That's. I thought that was that a troll syringe. No, it's Ben. Actual footage nope. of Ben. Actual is, that a, is that a syringe or a rolling pin? It's one of the other. That's others. a melodica! Translator. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. It kind of looks Gosh. like a piece of meat on a bone for some reason. I don't know. You know what? <laughs> I, I, there's a reason. <laughs> I I love that do like we we've not even like actually started the session yet and we're already like at each other's throats. <laughs> yeah. no, no 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 a better way but where we haven't even started it everyone's roasting me it's not yeah. even to add anyone else it's just me. It's, it's what you deserve. Ben is not handsome. Ben is a weird person. You know what? I'm trying to get you know, cat in yeah. my territory. I think he is quite little the the outsider. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You don't deserve. You don't deserve to be in this group. You were not originally like a, an actual this... person. <laughs> now this don't tell them that I'm actually has... the this only is... human. <laughs> this is I just yes. the only person this playing a you. human. Hey, I'm human. At no, one point not. in time, you're, I was human. You're a fucking I was cowboy. human. You're a weird I, cat. That's why. That's why I said I was human, and now I am no longer human. I am cat. 
I don't like these isekai protagonists. So this isekai protagonist can go away now. Can we kick him through the portal? Back no, no, the I'm portal? isekai. I, I am definitely not the protagonist, though. Can we can we kick him back in the portal? Can, can we get a different one? <laughs> Is that it? We, we need can a do that? guy from Strange <laughs> can, can I get a mulligan on our isekai? Like, for real. <laughs> can we get the guy from Strange the Paradise so we can just be like, alright, we're heading this way, and he goes, WHAT IS CHAOS? <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what happened. Just calm That's down, we'll get you the chaos. Yes, we legend, need to kill yes. chaos. Yes, chaos. <laughs> chaos. Why do you yell no at me, legend? What have I done? Hello. Oh, I can do this now. Let me. Where is this? There we go. I just need to see that. Okay, uh, I should probably open up. Dang. Just stop <laughs> watching you talking to on the Discord. He's in the Discord call sometimes, what? maybe. Yeah? Huh? See? He spoke. Uh, I can. He can. He speaks. Those are his first words, you see. Oh, hopefully can, the DM can actually speak. And I can type. Mm, I am all first powerful. Words, first it's not for a DM to have. Yeah. Um, yeah, so, with... Uh, is everyone uh, good on setup at this point? Yeah. I was yeah, born man. ready. All right. Uh, I would recommend us. everyone introduce themselves in presumably an orderly fashion. Which way? Mm. <laughs> Start from below. What is? Wait, how does it below? What's what the order? What do you mean below? The What's order below? of the voice the channel. The voice oh, the channel. voice channel. <laughs> that is so much more work to look at. Can we go by the roll twenty order? This is left to right. Is there a roll twenty order? Oh yeah, fair yeah. enough. The one, yeah, with the names. Yeah, all right, left or right then. I have yeah. legs, Deb. I, yeah, I do have legs somewhere. Haha, <laughs> you have to go last. So That's left fine. Right. That's Hello, fine. DM, please look at roll 20. <laughs> yeah. DM, please. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> DM, um, introdu introductions. Right, uh, so I'm Shirana Itsuki. I am uh, just sort of here to facilitate everything that's going on. Uh, I designed the uh, domain of dread that these unfortunate souls are being dragged into today, and um, that's about it. <laughs> that's so wonderful. You're god. I don't like this god. <laughs> <laughs> can we? Can we get? A, you want a new isekai? Now you want a new god. I want you everything. If God gives you lemons, you find a new god. You're very picky. I'm super picky. If I don't like it, I'm gonna. I'm go I guess I'll go to a different world then. See you guys, bye! Alright, okay, bye! Uh, Wait, what? Huh? You can do that? Work. Yeah, find a portal where you just get out of here. Was an option? It was yeah. an option? <laughs> Always! What? Wait. Mm -hmm. I missed what was going on. I was just finding the mind chat. Now I don't know what's happening. Introduction. You can get a portal and go home. Yes. Oh, what else? I don't want to go home. Why I got in this place? I know this is like a domain of dread and probably gonna be terrible and horrifying and they're probably gonna have like trauma, but like You're gonna it's die probably first. still better than where I'm at. <laughs> you one would think. Mm-hmm. It's alien's turn. Okay. So I am your alien boyfriend. Who's alien boyfriend? Yours. Um I am playing oh. Errol Mountain Pine. Um, he is a shifter barbarian, um, and I'm very, very excited because I've never played a barbarian before. <laughs> I'm excited for you, too. Why are you still both in my chat? Because oh, I can! You can't stop me! I'm I can put you into jail. I think there's- I can put you into jail, I'm pretty sure. Like, isn't there a timeout setting? There's a timeout. I can put you into timeout. Oh, no. No, I don't want to be timeout. <laughs> yes, um, I'm not the bride as I, I, I set up. No, Spill. I don't want. Spill. What's up? What? What's Spill. up? Bill, you have to introduce you. yourself. You. Mm, do I? Yeah. Can we okay. Kick him out? <laughs> <laughs> I'm in deep spill. Hi, I am loud and I make noise. I have. No, why am I hearing myself? Gailey, I had your stream <laughs> open and I heard myself. Ah! Not my anyways, fault. I'm hi. I'm- I'm- <laughs> <laughs> I'm- I'm Nisco. I- I'm very scuffed, um, uh, and I just wanna have a good time. I am- I'm clean- I'm- I'm playing a bard who's gonna 
make lots of weird noises and, and be scared of the fighting and just hide behind like a tree or something and be moral support. So I'm basically here to be useless. Be like, you can do it! <laughs> that, and also that try sounds... not to be a... Try not to be too bull get bullied too much by you, but I feel like just this like 15 minutes since we've been live is enough to say that that's probably not going to work out. <laughs> you might be in store for more than just normal frights, yes. Yeah. My chat said that they would betray me for you, Ari. Fuck you, ah! legend! Yay! <laughs> I love you guys! Everybody loves a cat girl. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say, it's, it's the cat girl charm. Didn't you say your Christmas is your lowest stat? That's a lie. <laughs> it is. It's your lowest stat. Look. It's, it's, I have a, it, it, it's a nine and I have a negative one. Very apt there, Maple. Thank you for the sad violin sound. Very, very. <laughs> <laughs> How are you doing, Maple? What's up? I'll go ahead and introduce myself then. I'm Sikim01, the current computer virus controlling this. And, uh,. I'm playing a human rogue named Alexander Trapp, who happens to pretty much be a snake oil salesman, who we'll have quite a lot of fun with. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alexander mm. Trapp, <laughs> you're a I, trap. I will, be, uh, I will help you in in the selling of the stuff, and um, if you find missing things, it's not me. <laughs> I feel like she'd probably find help you find products, and but yeah. then won't let you actually have them. Yeah. I mean, I don't steal, but I mean, if you want to, I don't have any problem with that. I'm just, if I'm just getting products. Mm. Simply use your pickpocketing skills to switch out people's wallets for stuff that Alexander is selling. Yeah, that sounds oh, like it works. Mm. Like, small <laughs> Just like, that's I don't remember idea. buying yeah. this. That's right, you did it. Yeah. Uh, no, you obviously bought it. I who cannot drew that? Who drew that? fucking believe who did this. this? On my, who did this on the bird? Who did that on the bird? What bird? What on my, what on my bird? bird? Who did this on the bird? <laughs> I like who wrote that? From that <laughs> <laughs> who did this on the bird? I don't know who did it, but it's funny. <laughs> anyway. uh, I fucking love D&D. &D. <laughs> yeah. Uh, my turn. I am Yuri. Yeah, I am Kako, basically. And you is character who likes shiny things, so um, try not to keep shiny things on you, cause um, they're God, gonna I'm end gonna up in my so pocket. So many shiny eventually. things for <laughs> a very short period of time. They're gonna be in my pocket, so just, 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 just a, a warning beforehand. Yes. One moment. Yes, one sec. One sec. <laughs> That's completely understandable, that Maple. I don't want to work either. I'm pretty sure I made a little note that I said it. Like, am I sure I'm not a bird? My my beautiful fiance ran in apologizing profusely yeah. because they needed to get their headphones. <laughs> you see, it says, uh, shiny things are life. Are you sure she's not a bird? I don't, am I a bird? Am I a cat? I don't know. Could be either. Are my ears in I, I diagnose you with raccoon. Oh, that, I know that that's actually very more fair. More likely. Yeah, that's yeah, it's fair. That means my ears aren't cat ears, but raccoon ears. Raccoons are basically <laughs> just cats with hands. What do raccoon ears look like? Hang on, I, I now have to look yeah. up a raccoon. They're round. <laughs> oh my god. I'm pretty sure they're round ears. They're they're like, like roundish. they're like roundish, like straight. triangular. Everybody looking at raccoons now. <laughs> Am I a raccoon? Am I no longer a cat? They they have very cat like ears actually. I was gonna say they actually kind of look like cat ears. <laughs> I love well, that. No, I, I looked up raccoon and one of the images is a raccoon holding up two peace signs. <laughs> I'm seeing the exact same one. <laughs> That's the only thing you need. There's to one see. holding a guitar right. and holding up like a a, a rock <laughs> hand symbol. <laughs> This makes so this is delightful, actually. Yeah, you got raccoon though. You still got raccoon. Stuck though. in the sewer, unfortunate. I legendary nightmare. Hello. Oh, that one. A raccoon oh. stuck in sewer cover, freed by firefighters. Okay, apparently they got out. Nice. Huh. <laughs> According to CNN. But see what? So we were okay, playing D and D, right? That's what we're doing. Yeah, we're playing D and D. We are? Yeah. What? We are? No, we're talking we're, about raccoons. Introductions handled. We're actually started soon. Started soon. Okay. Yep. Past started started the future soon. tense. <laughs> I am the manifestation of time, in fact. 
So you say. Well, if it's past tense and future tense, doesn't that like average out the present tense? Well, by, Good point. By being <laughs> our DM, uh, by agreeing to be our DM, you, oh. you have in fact become God, so. I ascend oh. to become the physical laws of reality, and none of them work properly. <laughs> My friend was telling me earlier today that they got kicked out from using, uh, well, not kicked out, but they got banned from using charisma characters because they accidentally became <laughs> God far earlier than they should be able to because of their charisma. <laughs> oh, so if you have the charisma, you can become God. Okay, nice. Apparently, nice apparently they started, a, like, they used their charisma to start a religion and get such a cult following oh. that they ended up gaining divinity and becoming God. That's Oof. not a bad idea. That sounds smart. <laughs> that what is your inner religion piece? The, the praise the shiny things? Give me all your shiny things? Of course. I mean, yeah. I mean, you could make a religion saying to cast away your shiny things and that you will keep them yeah. from them. Because yeah, they are the... sinful. You can make a religion yeah, yeah. this. Cast away and materialism. It's... Give away all of your valuables to me and to I will me keep them safe for you. <laughs> Yeah. Just why just why do I feel like I'm gonna be like the one rational character? <laughs> you definitely are brain. the only. That's exactly uh, how the situation maybe. is. Yes, there's a kitty, kitty cam. We don't have a kitty. Queen, so, so someone's gotta be. Honestly, when I, were, when I was looking at the list of uh, classes, I was like, oh no, I feel really bad for the barbarian. <laughs> <laughs> well, this I'm 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 basically I've basically agreed to be like the one teenager with a group of five year olds, uh, Ooh, trying to keep them entertained. Are you, are you the I teacher? Just... Or are you the parent then? I, f I feel like I'm a feel teenager like like because I, I know like like... I know what I'm doing a little bit more, but not all the way. I feel like they're like they're like in the Big Brother Big Sister program. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just keeping an eye on all of us. <laughs> well, it's gonna be fun. Good luck trying to have, um, keep an eye on you. Shiny thing, I'm already <laughs> over there. I'm already gone. Uh, the babies will be sad. <laughs> I just know when I was picking my class and character and all that, I paid absolute no attention to what anyone else playing. I picked purely based on what I thought would be in play. And if it doesn't work in the party, that's not my fault. I mean, well, well, I mean, if it doesn't totally work in the party, fault, it is it is quite literally your fault. But it's definitely um, totally my fault. But it's not my fault. Party I've ever seen. Don't worry, guys. Um, I, I actually, I, I picked my class based on, like, what everybody else was doing, because I was, like, I, I wanted to play Phil regardless, because I knew it would probably make me play something I hadn't played before, um, and mm -hmm. I also was, like, I, I need to be sure that we're taken care of, so that's why I was, like, very adamant, like, early on, I was, like, what are y'all playing? Please tell me. <laughs> I, I haven't. I was I playing a little played, bit of Phil as well. I just haven't I, played uh, enough D and D to um like. Oh, sorry, sorry. You can email. You know, no, you're fine. Good. Yeah. Okay. Luckily I was saying, for I, just, you, I haven't we're play some D and D now. Oh my yeah. god! Nice. Yeah, I just I haven't played enough D and D to be able to like play a, a character that I'm not like. A class that I'm not like interested in playing as the class itself, rather than playing one because for the sake of practicality, if that makes mm. sense. I've never played, so I chose one that I would be interested in and is more me than anything. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. That's sneaky. the same logic for me. Um, Anyways, I think yes. We're going to conduct these initial scenes in right to left order on Roll Twenty because okay. that just happens to work out best. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's me then. Yep. So, uh, Yu Yu is currently scoping out the last known location of the infamous Edwards Diamond. Uh, this red diamond has been stolen approximately 7,000 times over its history. <laughs> that doesn't sound like it's a very, like... Diamond. A well defended target if it's been stolen that much. <laughs> we, we should probably well, mute while other it. people are getting single yeah, scenes. Yeah. <laughs> I'll do them. Um, I'll uh, mute myself in Discord for that. Talk um, to my chat. Why? This is the gem. I need it. I have to yes. be one of them. The last place anyone has seen this particular object was uh, a little hideout in the woods just outside of town. 
and you've tracked that place down. Congratulations. Yes, I got there first. I got the information first. It's going to be mine. That's the plan. So, um, this hideout is nothing fancy, as far as you can tell. A uh, bit of a just wooden exterior. Hmm. Not even glass in the windows. Um, huh. Bit hastily constructed as well. Possibly they were caring more about getting this put somewhere than necessarily somewhere secure. They prioritized <laughs> not having the information get out. But, mm -hmm. well, that didn't work out too well for them either. A bit suspicious, though, for it to just be like that. Hmm. Well, you've yet to determine whether or not it's actually here. Ah, true. You haven't seen it yet. Mm -hmm. What is your current plan? So, the lo so, what we know is the location of the gem might be in there. We don't know if it's actually- I don't know if it's actually in there, do I? Mm, you haven't seen it there yet. You I haven't really gotten a good look into the hideout. Um, I guess I'll look around the actual area first, just in case it's not a trap. Because if it's just... As you said, it was more like a hastily... Is it hastily built? Or is it just yep. like a ruin and someone just popped it there? Uh, yeah, it, it's a rush job of construction. Hmm. Uh, yeah, then I'd, I'd, I'd probably look around the area, just in case it's not, it's not a trap or something. Alright, I would like you to go into your character sheet and click on the survival skill to roll. Survival, survival... Like that? Yep. Eight. Eight. Well, um... You take a glance around the forest. Mm. Seems clear enough. Mm -hmm. uh, so there's no glass. And is there a door or is it just... There is a like door. It's windows got kind of thing. sort of a chained padlock sealing the door. Not and necessarily the, as well as it wind... could be sealed. but. Huh. Yeah. And the windows don't have glass on it? Nope, not yet. So they're just like... Uh, what are they called? Just like, like a cut-out square kind of thingy that you just peek through, yeah. I guess. Can I peer through that? How tall is it from the ground? Or is it uh, just not too tall. Is... It's it's kind of a one-story hut. Prefabricated mm. walls that were just nailed together out here. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna uh, peer into the area. Just just a little glance in. All right. Um, there's no proper floor, but there is a nifty pedestal with a glass case containing a red gemstone. Oh, mmm. So there's... Can I, uh, so, that, so there's nothing on the floor, just a pedestal with the gem. It's not so much that there's nothing on the floor, there's just not a floor. Not a floor? There's a ground, but uh, they didn't, like, lay down any material. Okay. Uh Okay. It's kind of grassy. Huh. Can I look up? Uh, yeah. The uh, roof is well supported. Hmm. Think, Looks think. like it won't fall in. Yeah, it might not fall in, but the ground might also have might be trapped. Is it so? Is it just dirt? Like nothing yeah. on top of the dirt? Grass. Grass is on top of the dirt. Grass is on top of the dirt. Ugh. I don't want to just walk in there. Uh, is there a, like, any rocks around the actual thing so I can throw it on the ground? Just, just to make sure. It's definitely going to be easy to find a pebble in the woods, yeah? Mm. Okay, I, I find pebble, I throw the pebble inside. Alright, it bounces on the ground, seemingly, uh... Just as you would expect it to. Okay, yeah, seems good enough. How big is the actual window? Uh, big enough. You can big get enough. through. Okay, uh, I'll go you through, just... but I'm not jumping on. I'm not jumping, dropping to the ground just yet. All right, you can sit in the windowsill. Uh, I'm so I, it's suspicious to be, but also shiny gemstone. Oh yeah, 
yeah, my flaws. When I see something valuable, I can't help but think I'm already gonna steal it anyway. It's mine anyways. Okay, I'm going in. I'm taking it. It's mine. All right. You wander over to the pedestal, open the glass case, and pick up the diamond. Yep, there goes my flaw. I, I gotta pick it up. Can I just examine the diamond a bit more, though? Sure thing. What would you like to know about it? Uh, what knowledge do I actually have on the diamond? Um, well, it's called Edward's Diamond. It is mm. very valuable, and mm. it is very rarely with one person for longer than a month mm. at a time. Uh, was there any description of what it looked like? Uh, yeah, it is a red diamond uh, cut in a roughly um, uh, cylindrical, not like an actual cylinder, but rounded and tall type uh, arrangement. Mm -hmm. I don't know the proper jeweler's terminology for the shape, but... Huh. Uh, and it's basically exactly matched to what I have in my hand now. Yep. This fits the description of what you were looking for. Okay, yeah, seems good. We have the, I have the gem now, I'm putting it in my bag. Uh, I yep. guess I'll go out the same way I came in, the window. Alright, uh, you glance toward the window, notice, huh, it's kind of foggy, it wasn't before. Weird. But sudden changes in weather are usually not that big of a deal around mm. here. That's true. So, you clamber out of the hut and uh, make your escape. Is it st still foggy, huh? That's yep. really weird, but I should know my way back to the city, maybe? Hopefully. You should know your way back to the city. Should. You definitely should be able to find your way back to the city, and it's weird how long you've been walking without getting back to the city. Hmm. I'm gonna Very... guess it's like just a one straight direction towards the city. Like, yeah. I know I just, it's just one straight line. I know I didn't take any turns. Like, why am I not back yet? There's not really any place where there could have been weird directions for you to get lost. Oh, great. I'm lost. <laughs> <laughs> in the meantime, in a completely different reality, oh. Alexander. Yep is uh going about his normal business you've that normal your business cart. happened to be uh what you've got your cart you've got everything yep. you need just strolling about trying to find or what was it i'm trying to remember at least what i told you i saying that his thing was um he was going into the forest to try and find something to sell for the day yes you are currently scavenging it sounds like Mm-hmm. Pretty much. <laughs> All right. Well, any idea what you're looking for? Uh, <laughs> sorry, it's, it's very open-ended, so I'm just trying to think of it. Um, Fine. But uh, basically, I guess Alex would be going about the forest, trying to find literally anything that maybe looks somewhat valuable. Maybe sort of a, maybe a rock that's slightly glinty, or maybe a uh, possible plant that may or may not... Uh, be actually to have any sort of use <laughs> all right um well go ahead and roll me a perception check by opening your character sheet and clicking on the skill okay i am i'm very bad with roll 20 so is it, is it there it is i got that is a 21 very good <laughs> no do i even <laughs> have I, I do have well yeah i do have kind of high perception that's why yeah 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 um, so, as you're poking around in the forest, uh, you notice off to the side of the road, uh, what appears to be a crashed cart. Somewhat similar to yours, however, it's got a, a little bit more of a, um, ragged exterior. Can I, uh... uh particularly oh, wait, given that it, you know, is crashed on the side of the road. Go ahead. Mm. I was about to say, can I roll perception or rise? I literally just did that, and that's what made me see it. Um, yeah. <laughs> but um, do I see, like, I just want to know if I see, like, any, like, tracks from it or anything like that, or possibly anything maybe inside it from where I am? 
Like, uh, how far away is it from me? Well, uh, that depends on whether you want to go check it out or not, but uh, it's not too far off the side of the road. Kind of uh, 20 feet before slamming into a tree. Mm -hmm. Maybe someone I know, because I've, I've known a few travelers happen to pass through here, and well, maybe I should introduce myself or check on them. So I think I will go over to it. All right. Um, upon approaching this vehicle, you're not able to determine where its owner may have gone, uh, but you do notice there's a odd mechanical noises coming from uh, the covered part of the wagon itself. Mm. Just <laughs> hang on, I'm trying to think. Sorry, I, it, it takes me a little bit to get into character for stuff, but All um. Of it. Yeah, so, like, what contraption could this be? Or not contraption? I don't know. <laughs> Sorry, I'm very nervous. I haven't played D&D &D in about maybe a year or so. Perfectly fine. But, um, can I... I think his curiosity would make him check the card, so can I possibly look inside it? Yes, you're able to lift up the uh, tarp that covers the bed of the wagon. And you're able to see in the back a... Odd contraption churning away, gears a whirring. Um, it's a little bit difficult to determine what the purpose of this device is. <laughs> um, it seems to have a couple different spinning gears that are um, external, and the rest of the machinery is within a brass casing. I will just quickly go, or I will stand around and go, Hello? Is anyone around here? Does anyone own this? Uh, Do it. Does, you does anyone respond? No particular responses back other than a couple of uh, early morning songbirds. Well, I might not know what this contraption is. But as no one seems to be owning it, therefore I would not be stealing if I took it. I could possibly pawn this off to someone. Uh, how heavy is it? <laughs> um, it weighs approximately 35 pounds. Oh. Hmm, <laughs> oh. Can I roll to see if I can lift it? It's probably very dangerous too, but... <laughs> uh, sure, you can make a strength check. Perhaps with the athletics skill. Probably works. Oh, the athletics skill? Okay. Is that the one I have perception in? It is not. I realize I have nothing in anything for strength. <laughs> Gotta... Ah, it's easy enough for you to lift it because it has <laughs> a handle on the top. Oh, well, lovely. <laughs> yes. So uh, uh, when I take it out and outside, can I inspect it a little bit more? Yeah. There is an odd... Uh, protrusion from the opposite side of the gears. Um, it looks kind of similar to... I, I feel like Alexander would be familiar with cannons, at least on like a conceptual level. Uh, but this mm -hmm. is very small for what would be a cannon. Hmm, this seems some sort of projectile launcher or something? Uh... What is this doing in a cart? A crash cart? <laughs> oh my god, he's got a gun! <laughs> um, so it still has like gears whirring and stuff like that, right? Yeah, it seems to be on. <laughs> I was about to say, is there a way I can turn it off? Um, there's a lever on uh, on one side. Just a very small one. More of a switch, honestly. Just a big switch. Mm -hmm. I'm going to try pulling it and seeing what happens. All right. The gears begin to turn faster. It seems in my pursuit of turning this beast off, I think I have turned it somehow more on. Uh, is there... Is there, like, a place where you can put in a projectile? Um, there's a bit of a hatch on top of the uh, device, yeah. Okay, I want to open it. Alright. Doesn't seem to be anything in here at the moment. 
there is a couple there, there's a few wisps of smoke escaping from the internals of the device mm -hmm. I just want to test this not sure I wanna... if that's supposed to happen or not <laughs> true uh, I just want to test this can I put like a because it, it's I know it's some sort of projectile launcher I think right yeah it seems to be I want to see if it's hmm is there is there anything in the cart as well that seems to be a projectile specifically fires? Um, upon taking a look back into the cart, you notice a collapsed crate, more like a toppled crate. The lid mm -hmm. has fallen off. There are small fabric balls filled with uh, some sort of seed. Seed? Yeah. Wait, so is, is, this, is this a farming tool? Well, they're, like, sewn shut. It's just sort of fabric orbs. They seem to oh, have I used see. a form of grain to just keep the shape. Ah, oh, right, I see. So they are they are still projectiles. It's just, it's not... I was just thinking the idea of a farmer revving this up and shooting it all <laughs> over his field to plant it instead. Hey, I mean, it's a novel approach to pest control. I'll give it that. <laughs> I like the idea that uh, Alexander now wants to sell this as a farming tool. So, uh, can I put the switch in a different direction so it is not whirring as fast? Um, you can return it to its previous position, at which point uh, the gears will speed up again. Wait, does it just speed up endlessly? Uh, a bit more smoke is coming out of the machine at this point. <laughs> Did did someone design this machine with no off switch? I I don't know who invented this, but I have no idea their goals. But I can sell it as maybe something else. Uh, can I? I want to. I'm worried to put this in my cart. I feel <laughs> it's inherently dangerous. So, <laughs> hmm. But it would probably sell for a lot. If someone could dismantle it, it would definitely be worth it. Hmm. I think I'm going to try and put this on my cart. All right. Uh, it is not difficult to put in the cart as a, you just put it there. Mm -hmm. Easy enough. It stays. Continues right. to <laughs> be whirring endlessly. And <laughs> potentially overheat given the amount of uh, vapor roiling out of it at this point. Mm -hmm. But uh, you oh, have it. I'll take some of the seed packets as well. Actually, yep. wait. I realized something that I should have done that I didn't think about. Why don't I put one of the packets in the hatch and see what happens? All right. Um, I would like you to Hopefully roll outside the, of the cart. <laughs> sleight of hand skill. Sleight of hand? All right. Yeah. This one, oh, this one's a six. Of course, I last year were 21s, but... <laughs> All right. Uh, you hold one of the seed packet things and just kind of push it into the uh, the device. Um, mm -hmm. And it is torn from your grip and launched out the front of the, uh, the, pro uh, the projectile launcher, as, as you would expect. Kind of, uh, mm -hmm. kind of startles you. Um, kind of twists one of your fingers not great <laughs> it twists one of my fingers uh you'll be fine but you know might be a safer Ouch. way to use this <laughs> this thing seems to have a bit of bite to it <laughs> but it definitely works uh, you hit a tree hmm. i wonder who would buy this though it's, it seems too dangerous. Well, if I downplay the danger a little bit, maybe someone will be able to buy it. I think I will try and take the take it all back to town with me and sell it to someone. All right. You pack up the device and a reasonable number of seed packets in your cart. Uh, it is, oddly enough, the gears are spinning faster than they were before without you even interacting with the switch. Oh, I but, might need to get this back to town as fast as I can. Yeah. <laughs> uh, as you 
push your cart full speed ahead, uh, you notice, hey, that's that's just that's a lot of smoke, <laughs> and it, it's starting to impair your your own ability to see where you're going. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Luckily, I I have no idea where I can <laughs> see, but <laughs> I I think I could still make it back to town and maybe sell this as a um a, a device for uh, ceremonies. Yes, a, a a smoke machine, maybe as someone would call it. Yep, Alexander is reasonably confident that he will be able to make it back to town. Elsewhere in the multiverse. Um, Ben Newman is just Hello. kind of hanging out. Vibing, chillaxing, yep. you know, usual. You're out and about. Um, mm -hmm. You've noticed I am. a couple minutes ago uh, yeah. an, a little black and white tuxedo cat. Oh, can I had, pet it? Uh, had been paying attention to you. And yes, you did briefly interact with it, gave it some pets. Nice. As one does. Nice. And uh, then went about your business mm -hmm. and okay. glanced over your shoulder. Uh, uh -huh. hmm, what that's, is... that's the same. That's the same cat. That cat following me? Maybe I'll take it home with me and have a new pet cat. Perhaps. Uh -huh. Um, yeah, maybe. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> In the meantime, what are your current plans? Well, uh, assuming based on what I told you about my, my uh, uh, the X story and all that is, uh, he's is he already is he on his way to or is it already at or what for like the, the concert thing? A concert? Yeah, you, yeah. you'd be on your way there, which is why you didn't have much time to stop. Yeah, I just had it and I carried on, and so now I'm. Make it walk, walk in, uh, I'm assuming, I'm walking down the street towards, yep, towards the venue. And, about a uh, block and a half uh, away. Yeah. It's kind of like, I got some tunes playing in uh, headphones, kind of vibing, going through, making sure, kind of like doing like a last second, like patting down my pockets, making sure I'm not missing anything that I might need to, you know, have. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And, um, it's kind of doing like some uh, deep breaths. Like, Calm, like, calm the nerves. He's very, very nervous. And yeah, yeah. yeah. There's no one to talk to, so he doesn't really say anything. Right. I'm not going to be one of those people who monologues to themselves. Um, for no reason. Yeah. But if there's good reason, he'll do it. But like right now, there's yeah. no good reason. Fair enough. Um, yeah. You're able to arrive at the venue reasonably unaccosted. Mm -hmm. Reasonably. Luckily for you. <laughs> Uh, you do notice as mm -hmm. you're, uh, in just sort of the coat room. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. Uh, the cat has, uh, slipped in behind you. It's in the building, currently. A little odd. I'm kind of like, kind of looking at, like, wasn't there, like, a doorman or something? I didn't know that they let pets in here. Whoa. Is this, like, someone's, like someone's pet maybe maybe it wasn't following me maybe it was coming here ah, maybe not my problem going back to putting my coat away and getting going to the uh, equipment room to do a, an equipment check yep making my you way open. downtown walking <laughs> fast kitty passing up views bound -da 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 -da. sorry i was reading i was reading i was reading aliens chat <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um. anyways yeah yeah as you arrive at the equipment room, you find the door to be a bit stuck, oddly stuck. enough. Yep. Like, why isn't this... Why isn't this open? I'm kind of, like, nudging it. Opening the thing. Is it a pole, maybe? No. Jiggling the, 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 the door and that, and uh, then I knock. Alright, you knock on I the... Knock. uh door. Hello? You knock on the door. Is anyone in there? The door's stuck. Oddly enough, you hear somebody s shouting out something along the lines of, Hello? Is there anyone nearby? 
Yeah? Who's that? There's no further response. Hi, Ouch. Yeah, thank you. I definitely do. Yeah, there's a cat. Always have the cat. Sorry, responding to my chat. Carry on. Mm-hmm. Speaking of that cat, it begins to scratch at the door to the equipment room. From, like, the other side that I can't get no, into? No, from where you are. Oh. Oh, hey, little guy. You need, what do you what do you want to go in there? No. I you'll go you'll get all over the, the equipment. I'm gonna pick up the cat and I'm gonna move it behind me. All set right. it down. And I'm gonna pet it though. Obviously you gotta pet it. You can't interact with the cat without petting it. That's like an international interdimensional law. Mm-hmm. It makes <laughs> squinty eyes of being patted. Yeah, 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 yeah. And <laughs> and I and then I go back to jiggling the doorknob to try and open the door. Alright. Do you have any method of uh, forcing the door open? No. I don't want to All damage right. the door. The venue that's will fair. get mad and make me pay pay like damages. Actually, <laughs> that's that's a good thought. I'm going to go and I'm going to leave the door and I'm going to go find an employee and be like, hey, uh, can't get into equipment room. I need to you know, get my gear in there, check my gear. What's going on? Oh, right. Um... Is it is it just locked? I don't know. It wasn't opening. The door was the the, the knob was turning. Oh well, let me take a look. Okay, thanks. The employee thank you. will follow you to the equipment room. And uh, he will grab a hold of the doorknob and open the equipment room. There huh? you are. A massive cloud of mist is pouring out of the door. Huh? What? Huh? I'm gonna like take it like a step back like what? It's all this Seems to mist. be open. Uh, God, someone smoking too much? I thought this was no smoking area. Why is there so much smoke? Who was smoking mm. so much in there? Sorry, I'm not sure what you're referring to. You don't see all this mist smokiness? Um, it's a little musty in the equipment room. That's about it. I swear I didn't drink that much last night. Cat dashes <laughs> into the room. No, cat, no, no, not my equipment. I chased after the cat. Alright. I know, that's what I'm saying. In the meantime, uh, Errol. What's up? You have been in Alunia for a while. You've picked up a little bit of the local information. And you know, both from personal experience and from talking to people, even noticing a couple of the newer people filtering in, uh, generally speaking, when somebody ends up here, they end up here at the top of the Lilland Steps. Okay. Uh, so, one day, just out of sheer curiosity, you figure you'd visit there. And as you arrive, you notice, uh, a cart and two cat people. <laughs> um, did Everyone they... else. Yeah, go ahead. Having uh, been engulfed in various vapors, um, you find that you are standing on the edge of a tall, tall cliff. Uh, surrounding you are each other. Kind of weird. This isn't <laughs> where you were planning to be. <laughs> Y'all all right? Wait, well, my car was moving. Is my car still moving? Um, uh, this isn't the city. Hmm. Your cart has gotten stuck in a rut. This is a really <laughs> weird design for an equipment room. Where's all the equipment at? Uh, this, is, this is the town? Did I, can, I, wait, can I look back into my cart and see if the machine's still there? Yes, it is. And it has, in fact, stopped spinning its gears rapidly and overflowing oh. with smoke. Oh, let me change, let me update that. That, that one's done. 
What's Good. that you got there? Hmm. Hello? Who are you all? What's, what's I'm that? I'm fixing what's that, that right now. Out. This would be the cart of the great Alexander Trapp, world-renowned salesman. What else you got in there? Hmm? You have any musical instruments in there? I'm kind of missing mine. Is it all in your cart? <laughs> Sadly, currently all I have for my stock Hi, is boss this just messaged me. weird seed projectile beast. But uh, usually I have many absorbments of uh, exotic oddities and things many people would like to purchase for me. Hmm. But no musical instruments. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna assume none of y'all are hurt, then. Hmm? No. Well, why would I be hurt? Why? Honestly, oh. surprised I'm not. My cart was going... That le Actually, I don't know how fast it was going at this point. I, I, all I thought was smoke, and then... <laughs> well, now I'm here. This doesn't have to be the town I'm used to. Nah, Sorry, but... did you could, could you point me back to that town? I think I've taken a wrong turn somewhere somehow. I'm afraid uh, that's not possible. What? What do you mean it's not possible? What? Welcome to Alunia. Alunia? Where? Alunia. Where was that in relative to Glombleton? I ain't never heard of a Glombleton. I'm sorry. <laughs> Is that actually what I did in my town? I can't remember. I don't have a name. It's not cool, then that's what it was. <laughs> <laughs> I have it up just in case I forgot it. <laughs> well, at least you have a name. I don't got a name for my one. Uh, I'll just say it's just, it's just the, the real city. Word Everyone I... just refers to it as the city. Oh, Grand Rapids. That's where I came from. This isn't. What do you mean, Lonia? I thought we were in Grand Rapids. Where I've is... never even heard of Alonia. Uh, see... I've never heard of anything you guys just said. We'll see, Wait, uh. What? Alonia has a habit of taking hold of people and then not letting them go. That so now you're here. Like a, like a beast. Why are we here? Yeah. I don't know. It's like a... Wait. The... Uh, my name's what? Errol. You have cat ears? <laughs> the hell? You've got cat ears. Yeah. Wait, yeah. what? <laughs> what the... What are what you You huh? got cat ears as well. No, what? When did this get there? I reach over and pinch his ears. They're ah, real. That feels weird. They're real. See? <laughs> Yo, What's going weird. on? Uh. Gonna poke ear cat ears. Poke like, what can we actually mind. see right now? Because you just said we're on a cliff. <laughs> yeah, yes. um, um, how, how far are we from the ground? How big is this cliff? Well, What's the down cliff, below the cliff? So the cliff face itself uh, contains a convenient set of steps that seem to lead downward. So uh, hmm. if you were going to fall off a cliff, this is one of the best places to do it because you probably will hit ground before the the really far away ground. <laughs> uh, <I'm laughs> <ever> <laughs> However, you can't actually see that really far away ground because there's a curtain of mist. Oh, the there. goddamn mist again. Should should yes. we like describe our characters for each other, maybe? Yeah. Just so we know what we're all looking no, at. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you all know what you look like as art. Of course. Okay, okay. Um, I'm paying full attention now. I wasn't paying attention fully for a second. Yes, I had to I'll update the command. Sorry. How dare you not sorry. pay attention? <laughs> I'm disappointed sorry. in you. I'm disappointed in myself too. Anyways, yeah. Well, we can start with Errol. Um, so, so Errol is a is a shifter, and even outside of like their shifted forms, they tend to take on more like animalistic traits. Um, hmm. So he has more of like a gruff, almost you could call it canine ish face. It's not like an exact like dog face, but it's you know how like some Hollywood werewolves have it, where it's just kind of a little bit wolfy. Um, he's like, he's like that. He's got red hair, um, and it, it's, he's very scruffy, and he's got scars across his face. Ooh. You look like um. you've been through the ringer there, pal. <laughs> I'm a fighter uh. by nature. 
Um, um, I, I am, um, I'm six foot one with, uh, well, I, now that I've merged into a cat form somehow without realizing it, I have black and white fur, like, kind of like a, like, tuxedo cat style fur. Mm -hmm. Uh, uh, and, um, very, uh, very, like, thin life build. Okay. I don't, I don't know what else, I, I how else to describe him. He doesn't really have, oh, he has, he has, um, he has a nose piercing. Hmm. You have a tail? Well, um, yeah, I have a tail. It's a cat person. He has tail what and cat ears. tail, then? Like, um, cat tail? I don't the know, not kind. fluffy. Not a fluffy kind, uh, not like one of the short ones. Like, a, kind of like a medium long. Very, it, uh, it's a, one of those ones that, like, flips around a lot. And, like, wow. Very, very, <laughs> very movementy. <laughs> well, yeah, you don't know how to control yourself, so. Yep. Yeah. That makes sense, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, you, however, you look like you ain't gotten into a fight in your whole life. Why would I get in a fight? This cat's a weird one. What? Yeah, he is a weird one. What do you, I'm, what do you mean, cat? How do, do you want me to grab be your a tail? Nightmare. What? I have a tail. You yeah, and tail. it's kind of going yeah, everywhere no. right ah! now. <laughs> that feels weird. Stop it. Let go. I'm like, gonna be such a like... gremlin with you. I love this. <laughs> I'm like waving my arms at you to try and like get her to let go. Mm -hmm. How does how does the gamer look? How does Alexander look? Mm. But he's human, so he's probably the normalest one out of all of us. <laughs> <laughs> we got one human and a bunch of furries. <laughs> Not a furry. <laughs> okay. Cat. Um, so, are we still, like, Ben just having a crisis of, um, identity and existential crisis about being a cat boy now? Um, yep. so yeah, he's just kind of like sitting there, like, kind of like, very gingerly touching his ears, and then like, looking at, turning and like, trying to learn how to move the tail, not successful. I'm gonna, you know, peek into my, um, little bag for a moment there, just to make sure nothing's missing. By nothing, Everything. I mean a specific red thing is missing. Yeah, we'll just quickly turn into a furry D and D. Oh God. Um. Yeah. Everything in your bag, in all colors, is exactly where it should be. Good. Good. That's all that matters to me. Just, just the red thing. Yes. <laughs> Wait. Does that I can mean... pay attention to you guys now. If they, if they have the red I'm thing, does that mean that. I have my musical instrument with me? You have. Is it uh, carrying? Is it my turn to describe myself? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. Uh, Alexander Trapp is very much wearing, um, would be sort of a standard, at least in sort of Victorian area, uh, what a rich, uh, like, I would say sort of businessman would be wearing, but very much like if it was thrown in the trash for, like, a couple years, <laughs> as he basically did get out of the trash. Um, so he's a bit scruffy looking, not the cleanest individual, but, uh, mm. he's hardworking. <laughs> Certainly. Um, and you got the cart with you. Well, damn. Yes, uh, it's, it's a little bit ragged as well, but it's it's got good use. I want that cart. The hell happened to your <laughs> suit? Oh, um, well, beforehand, I must have, uh, let's see, when I was searching for some things itself for today, I happened to be going through the forest, maybe? I, uh, yes, the, the bramble must have, uh, torn it apart a bit and, uh, ripped it up. Uh, this, this doesn't matter. I have a mi billion suits at home. It's, um, I can just change out when I get back. <laughs> I don't think we well, can it's... get back. Could I? Why didn't you just have clothes on your cart? Why don't you? Could could I? Could I maybe roll insight on Alexander? Suspicious guy right there. <laughs> the UV can I? Can I? On your can end. I? Um, check Alexander's pockets as well, please. <laughs> I got a 25 on my insight. <laughs> oh. Interesting. Can I roll deception against that? Yeah, absolutely. Go ahead. 
Well, that is not. Um... <laughs> That's not good. Er- Errol kind of throws his eyebrows up at that, but doesn't say anything. <laughs> Once again, say that. can I check Alexander's the... pockets? That's the first la- layer of lying gone on Alexander there. <laughs> <laughs> lying the uh, war against Errol. It's up to Alexander. Well, it's not up to Alexander. It's up to Alexander. Uh, uh, you... No, you cannot check my pockets. Darn it. Uh, anyway, um... My name is Errol. Uh, I don't believe I caught any of yours. Uh, I'm Ben. Ben Newman. Alexander is going to quickly step up and go, yeah. Ah, yeah, I am Alexander Trapp, as I do think I pro- uh, proclaimed beforehand, the illustrious <laughs> salesman of Glombledon. That's You're a, a trap. <laughs> dude. I don't know what you mean by a trap. I am by in no way dangerous or in means to ensnare someone. You're suspicious. <laughs> no, I'm no more suspicious than your common salesman. How dare you? <gasps> yeah, you My did tell me. My common salesmen are, are not good people. Well, it's a pleasure to make your acquaintance, sir. Why, thank you. These one, this one seems to have some sort of manners. You, chance? Are are you a werewolf? Yeah, uh, something like that. Wait, what? I saw you. What? You mean that's not a human? I thought that was just a really hairy guy. Uh, uh the... <laughs> my, my, my race prefers the term shifters. We're not all wolfish. Wait, what's a shifter? Something's wrong with this cat. What do you mean? So you're, <laughs> something's wrong with you for thinking this is normal. It's normal, son? It's not it at all! Be a bit out of all the ordinary. Yeah, I've, I've seen right. plenty of cat folk. Yeah. What? Something's off with this cat. I don't know what's going on. And he's having an existential crisis. Okay. <laughs> lucky Ma- for you, well, not lucky at the moment, I think I sell something for an existential crisis. Do you now? <laughs> yes, a wonderful concoction. I currently it was not able to make some this morning because I happened to have found that thing and spent, well... I think most of my time uh, figuring out that, uh, but otherwise, if we find some ingredients for it, maybe I can make it for you. Um, uh, maybe first we what, should what, get what, y'all what, somewhere it's... safe before someone else shows up. Someone else? Well, if There's anybody else gets ported in. Ah. Uh, well, maybe someone else would be a buyer for this machine. Maybe someone else. By the way, would any find... of you like to purchase this projectile launcher of? Many illustrious qualities. Does it make cool sounds? I'm good. Can I? What would it be oh, the... to try and figure out what Ooh. the hell he has? <laughs> um. Well, uh, for you, I think a regular old history check is probably going to suffice. Okay. One sec. I still ask him if it makes no if it makes cool sounds. I got an eleven. I'm yeah. sure. Do you want it to make cool sounds? Oh. Wacky contraption yeah. is what it is. Then yes, it definitely makes the coolest of sounds. Oh, can I ben. roll an insight check? Poor Ben. Poor Ben. He's not okay. I, I'm smart enough to roll an insight check this time around. Okay. This Mostly because of that pause. Pause the pause button. There was a <laughs> pause button. Ah, <laughs> uh-huh. nine. Oh god, I don't think I know. Well, yeah, no, yeah, no. I'm very convinced. What did say you don't know? I'm very convinced. I don't want to be convinced, but I am. Ah, <laughs> oh, um, well, how much do you want for it? Wait, is anyone gonna say have... anything? No. Yeah. Uh, that's fine. He- he'll learn it. He'll learn his own. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna let him fl- like land flat in his face here. What's yeah, the, actually, you ask, know what? What's, Fuck it, sink what's or your swim. asking price there? <laughs> Why are you laughing? What's so funny? <laughs> nothing, nothing. Just, just keep going. Just, yeah. <laughs> well, this this businessman won't tell me he's asking. How much money do you have, sir? What I do don't you? know. I don't know. 
check your wallet. <laughs> I uh, I pull out like a like a like a five dollar bill, and I try to hand it to him. Does this do? What is that? What is? Is that a handkerchief? Are you going to try and buy this amazing, illustrious wonder of technical marble with a handkerchief? Did you just say technical marble? What do you mean? It's it's money. This is not any sort of currency I've ever heard of. Yeah, that's just paper. Where? Kind of gets quiet and surrounded all of you. Maybe he's like. I don't understand. What don't you understand? You should understand, sir. Is... You do not buy technology and machinery with a used handkerchief. It's... I mean, what do you mean used? It's green. Well, that's what color it comes to. It gets printed that color. What other, what other color printed? would it be? White. Like a normal handkerchief. I don't know. Some could no. be embroidered with blue. I've seen a few embroidered, yeah. I'm just gonna throw it at him. I'm just gonna throw the five dollars at him and turn around and scoff and cross my arms. <laughs> and, and walk off. You're walking off the cliff. No, okay. no, 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 no. <laughs> Throw him off not the off, cliff. Not off the cliff. It's <laughs> away from him. You're not satisfied with trying to hand me nothing for this machine. You decide to throw it to me anyways. You, you, you I probably... already take offense towards you. You probably shouldn't wander off by yourself. He's gone. He's eh. going. Should no, we... no. I'm not walking. I'm not wandering, walking off completely. I'm just taking a few steps away from him. Uh, okay. We could end up some bathroom. Bad could happen though in those few steps. You don't know it. So about getting y'all yeah. out of here. I'm gonna pull my phone out and and oh. wonder why it's not turning on. What the Shiny hell is thing. that? Shiny thing. <laughs> well, you they have a phone. Don't have service. Shiny thing. <laughs> What is that contraption? What is it's a that? Phone. It's Can a phone. I see it? Can I hold it? Can I keep it? <laughs> Wait, do we all see it or? I don't. I don't know about, but you can look at it. What is that light box you have? Um, it's a phone. A what? A phone. A phone. phone. What is that? Yeah. What's a talk phone? to people? Talk to people like a telegraph. Hmm. Oh, telegraphs like... are like a long time ago. This is like super telegraph, dude. Oh, like a like a, a like a stone of far speech. I I don't know what that is, but <laughs> I, I mean, far speech sounds accurate. I can talk to people who are far away. Yeah, so that's all right. It looks weird, but okay. I, I want it. I mean, it can also show it to per the person too. I want it. Can gonna, I have it? I'm gonna turn it on and go to like a gallery and find random pictures of musical instruments cats that he has on his phone. Yep. I'm Show staring them. at it now. I it's <laughs> tiny. I, I I'm tilting my head like a confused dog. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's shiny point, thing. How I can get it from him? That is got like a transaction. Glass case full of photographs that he's telekinetically moving. <laughs> it's kind of weird. It's very weird. Sir, sir. Sorry for our <laughs> uh, be a flip previous... Phone. Yes, it's totally a flip phone. <laughs> it's a Blackberry. <laughs> Wait. I mean, they still have cameras. Huh. Um, hmm. I'm just going to well, very slowly close it and put it in my pocket. He, he has a feeling that something's off here. Yeah, I so, make so, note if of you which would... pocket it is. Sorry for our uh, previous discussion, mind me. I may have been a bit rude there, and I do apologize. But um, that thing that you have would suffice as a possible payment for this amazing contraption you are fond of. You okay? No, no. Let me let me get this straight. All right. Uh, so yes. you you've yes. appeared in mm -hmm. a place where you don't know where it is. Yes. And your first instinct is to try uh -huh. and sell some shit that you found in the woods. Oh, you're talking to him, Matt. Yeah. Okay. Yes, yes. Well, I'm a salesman. That's what I do. I travel to many various lands of different exotic, exotic qualities <laughs> and so and so that I am used to. On accident? Sort of, sort of, well, you who know, would say what is on accident? You would say it on accident. Me, it was just on 
not Not entirely on purpose. (laughs) Uh-huh. I mean, Listen, a every good salesman will always look for a customer. So what would you say, sir? Try and try and push them a little bit away. <laughs> uh, no, Ben, <laughs> Ben, my, my friend, my fellow, my fellow like... like cat friend, Ben, Ben, please come over here. See, this man here, he's not a good person. That thing's not worth it. You should come this way. Just stay away from him. He's not so a good ben, person. So, Ben, would you like to purchase the machine? I mean, it, it no, makes no, no, very ben, cool ben, noises ben, like you no. would... And ben, I'd uh, listen, listen before. to your phone uh, chat. Uh, 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 it pulls out melodica and very overwhelmingly plays music. <laughs> okay. She's <laughs> <laughs> getting pulling him back in. <laughs> We're trying to get those stupid phone. <laughs> As amusing as this is, and it is very funny, don't get me wrong, I would really like to boot Scoot out of here. Okay, but where are we going? Into the city? Well, there's a city? Yes. There's a city? That's not a city I know of. Maybe I could sell this for something that's actually worth money. I only know one city. Yeah, yeah, you can hawk your wares there if we could just get a move on. Uh, can I ride in his cart? <laughs> can he move his cart? Can I ride in... uh, <laughs> so say, is my cart, like, stuck? Mm. Uh, one of the wheels is kind of, like, lodged in a uh, divot in the ground. I ain't helping him. I don't do physical effort. <sighs> The cat folk aren't that strong, you see? I'm... Can I roll a strength check to try to dislodge it? Absolutely. <laughs> it's gonna be... That's only 11. Does the owner of the cart wish to help? I was about to say, I can probably help. <laughs> yes. You get a 2. Wow! <laughs> very <laughs> close! <laughs> Only, only I mean, technically, it technically, technically, roll a two. <laughs> Did two plus? Actually, you're right. Yeah, it was is two plus one. <laughs> oh. Well, um, what helping is actually going to do is it's going to let Arrow roll twice and pick the higher number. Oh, sweet. <laughs> cool. Wow. wow. Yeah, sure. Twelve. <laughs> Look, it's it's not a very deep divot in the ground. Between two people, you're able to shove the cart onto its way. It's fucking amazing! Wait. <laughs> um, <laughs> I have another question. Um, this is a cart, right? But what's yeah. making yeah. the cart move? Well, currently, uh, a shifter barbarian and Alexander Trap. <laughs> so those are like horses to pull it or anything. Nah. Oh. I... So how are we I, trying I, to I, use I, it? I, 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 I think Alexander just realized this. What? So I'm gonna. I'm, I, I bet I'm gonna go? like. Oh, so this this doesn't move by itself. I'm assuming. Ah. Oh, okay. No, it so does need to be horse drawn. Well, you, know, you, know, you could have said that. Could have pointed it out before you guys put all the effort in the movie. That... Well, well, unfortunately, I, like I don't turn into no horse, so you might just have to leave this here. Mmm. Such a shame. We are on a hill, right? We are. <laughs> you... Are you gonna say that? <laughs> and we are at the top of said hill, correct? Sorry, I'm terrified yeah. of roller coasters. I'm not. I know this. <laughs> you guys have fun, Mr. Uh, Alexander. In a manner of speaking. We're on a cliff. Are you gonna push How... off the cliff? How good is the path? <laughs> Uh-oh. Down the cliff. Ah. Well, the path down the cliff resembles stairs in the uh, sort of back and forth winding fashion. Uh, you can't tell how far down they go. Uh-huh. Kind of like terrace. So yeah. you wanna you wanna try to roll this down the the hill without you know anything to control it. I mean. Oh God, he's thinking. I don't it. see any other option. <laughs> And he's thought of it. Um, I mean, the Literally. option is leave it here. We have legs. Or have crash legs. into yeah, something. I can't, I can't possibly, uh, but it has some wares to sell. And take Notably, it with you. For Errol, you would know, hey, uh, you don't really go down the steps. You don't go down there. Mm-hmm. Or at least you don't come back if you do. 
going down town there. Town is uh, the other way. Yeah, going down there anyway is a bad idea. Town is this way. What way? Sorry. Uh, I point. <laughs> north, north, uh, <laughs> east, northeastish. Well, then, how do we go that way? With our legs. We will. Yeah, if you would care to follow, I could lead you. Well, I went off this cliff, so. What? Hmm. I'm trying to, like, I'm trying to, I think Alexander is thinking, like, can it, can he possibly take the, where, or the thing he's trying to sell, leave the cart, and feel safe enough that it would not be stolen? I'm going to turn to to Alexander and say, hey, uh, looks like you're going to have to leave that there, but if you let me have that weird music box thing you were showing me earlier, I'll, I'll help carry some stuff. Mm. I think I'd rather trade that music box for that phone, that light box you were using. I'd rather you not trade that for the light box. <laughs> that might I mean, be a little dumb, that? but he, uh... Yeah, he knows the value of a phone, and he doesn't think it's the same value. Cannot wait for that phone phone to run out of battery. Can I roll a a persuasion? Uh, that's up to the target. (laughs) Wait, how is that up to the target? Um, well, so as it's player versus player. Yeah, if, it, oh, if it's it? like player stuff, uh, most DMs will let the players choose whether or not they can be persuaded through a role. Mm-hmm. I don't think he could be persuaded to give it away. Maybe if he had has seen the music box in use, well, quote unquote music box in use, <laughs> to see that, because right now he just thinks it, he it makes cool sounds. For all he knows, those could be cool, not enough cool sounds to be considered a nice musical instrument. That is true. Technically, I think the phone makes cool sounds. Mm. Yeah. Why do you think the phone is a really wanted right now? I mean, I did deceive you that it does make really, really cool sounds. Yeah, yeah. but mm. you deceived me that it made really cool sounds, but not like enough cool sounds. Like, Fine then. <laughs> I will ask, uh, is it Errol or whatever? Mm-hmm. Yeah, um, <laughs> sorry. Uh, <laughs> do you think anyone would steal the cart? Yes. I... <laughs> he just kind of, like, looks at you for a second, like, incredulous, <laughs> and yes. looks back at, <laughs> and looks back at Alex and says, I don't think anybody else is gonna come up this way. Darn it. Somebody might hmm. get brought here the same way y'all were, but I don't know that they'd be interested in the cart. Well, Seeing well, as there's so no way to get it off. Maybe the person who gets brought back is a horse. Oh. As long as we can maybe return and retrieve it. I, I do own many as many of carts, but they aren't they don't come cheap, so I would mm-hmm. like to keep this one in my employ. Well, uh, as as hopefully, we back, um, Hopefully, once you get yourself in the city, you can find somebody that can help you get it off out. Yeah, go mm-hmm. go buy a horse from the city. Sell your cool stuff. Buy horse to get for now. The cart to come back. Buy some more stuff. Uh, I'm gonna yes, try and lift the machine again if I can. Oh, you go, go. Yep, it's easy enough. Got a handle. All right. It's like I will bring this with us to the town. All also, right. the seed pack is just in case. Yeah. Okay, and then oh. I, I guess I'm going to start leading them to the city. Yep. As everyone follows Errol, uh, northeast-ish, uh, you emerge from the patch of fog that seems to linger on the cliffside into the single brightest place any of you have ever been. You're welcome. I hope you... Well, ouch. <laughs> Wait, right. I've heard a record... For the record, the whole entire march to the town, Ben is playing his melodica. <laughs> uh, the light is harsh and reflects off nearly every surface. It's almost unbearably bright. Errol, I'm already flipping up my hood. I'm flipping yeah. up my hood. 
Y'all, y'all, y'all's eyes will adjust. Ow! But just Other guys are sensitive, sharp. you know. I'm going into uh. Oh, well, Ben's gonna die. His eyes. There. <laughs> Yu Yu, wait, did you say your name yet, Yu Yu? I don't remember no, if your character. No, I, I've okay. Been, I've been um, like silent and doing okay. little talks, and then I, I, uh, I made sure everyone little, didn't pay little, much mind to me. Other cat, other oh. cat. Hmm. You like? You, I'll let you look at the thing if you if you if you guide me. I can't I can't see. How about you give me the thing, then I'll guide you. No, it's mine. Then no deal. Have fun. <laughs> hmm. Looks at Alexander. Was... Looks at I will Daryl. Just start. Wait. Looks in the general direction of the last time you heard their voices. Yeah. Help. <laughs> I'm just gonna start holding the thing I'm holding slightly above my uh, or slightly in front of my eyes instead. Um. Mm, yeah. I love having a hood. Notably, that brass case on that machine is also very <laughs> reflective. Oh, I didn't think about that. Is it along the whole thing, or is it on just the top? Yeah. Oh, boy. Oh, it's along the whole thing? Oh, well, then yeah, I, um... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hmm. Oh, This did boy. not seem to quell this fire like I had hoped. In fact, I think it's made it a bit worse. I'm just gonna lower it slightly then. Do you wanna... close my eyes instead. You wanna just stand here a second and let your eyes adjust? Is that what we must do? If that's what you need to do, How if it's that it bad. How long will it take? Oh, well, our eyes are quite sensitive to changes I of light, so it anything. might take a little bit. Yeah, you're not well equipped, are you? What's that supposed to mean? I don't think he even knows what a cat folk is. <laughs> you're a cat folk. You've got cat ears, you've got a tail, your eyes. I don't know how this happened. I didn't have them yesterday. Did you buy them? <laughs> I don't think I, I, so. I you know. Did you drink something? Who did you buy it from to drink? Or what drink did you buy from someone to get turned this way? Why are you interested? I didn't do anything. Well, if what? this is a thing I can sort of recreate, maybe it would sell quite well. Oh, boy. Wow. Mm -hmm. Perhaps. I will make the cat boy potion. <laughs> I will make a cat boy potion. Test it on yourself first, then. Oh, please. I have many servants who test on instead. Where are the servants Where are now, they? then? That sounds a little unethical. They're okay. at town, obviously. We'll do oh. Hmm. Wait, I thought one. you didn't know about Glam this town. No, Glumbledon. What? Yeah, that, well, that's... <laughs> the place that's really he said away, he was probably. from. Yeah? Yes. Yes, Glumbledon, the best town. <laughs> where, where, where exactly is Glumbledon? In his home, where he's from. <laughs> but how far away is that from here? Far away. Have to go through I a misty no thingy. Idea. See? And that's why I'm concerned about him and the servants and his testing. Will you <laughs> leave me alone, cat? Go up here! Okay, I'll pet you. Pet you. Stop. The actual Sorry. cat. Yeah, I'm <laughs> having an actual cat because it's just here. No, I stop. Fully assumed that was directed at you, you. <laughs> For a second, I thought about like, what did I do? I'm oh, staying I'm away from this place. To my, cat I'm talking to my actual cat. I'm sorry. Leave me alone. Uh, stop it. Um, Get off my keyboard and my mouse. <laughs> In the course of the conversation, it does become a little more, you know, tolerable that everything is reflective, and uh, so I can I can see now. Yeah, everyone can see. Okay. Not necessarily okay. like the most comfortable uh, viewing experience, but mm. you're not blinded at this point. Mm -hmm. No longer blinded by the light, wrapped up mm. like a deuce. You know the ruler <laughs> in the night. Exactly. Cool bean. So what, uh, what, uh, what, what, what happens when we enter town? Or are we not? I thought that's what we were at, right? I, I was, I was gonna say as soon as like everybody looks like they've got their bearings, I'm gonna start leading them again. 
Okay. Yep. That probably shouldn't take too long. So, Ooh. can we um, get a, a quick glance of the actual area? Um, yeah. So, the city that you appear to be approaching is uh, built over a river. Hmm. That's the main noteworthy feature on the, uh, like, broad levels. Hmm. Um, there is a tall castle in the center of the city, woods hmm. to the west, um, a lake, which is kicking up quite a glare uh, mm -hmm. far to the east. You can faintly hear rushing water. And uh, past the town is a large stone wall with uh, plenty of battle-equipped, like, uh, towers and crenulations. Mm. That's what you're able to gather from your mm. uh, view as you approach the city of Alunia. So wait. I'm making note of that castle. What's the name of the the this what's the name of this town, Errol? Elunia. 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 Okay. Let's see. Uh what do people do here? Oh, oh, spelled an O or C. I thought it was an E. There is an E. Well but it started in 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 never mind. Hmm? <laughs> e -me -me. <laughs> It's fantasy land, so names of stuff are weird. They have to look fancy as well. Very rude Please. to the French. <laughs> what? It looks fancy. All right. Um. Yeah. Oh there's not going to be any trouble getting into the city. No guards. Oh, well, there are people that look guardily around, but they're not troubling you at the moment. <laughs> Are they going to take issue with my giant contra- or with my contraption? That's uh, reflecting light <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> surprisingly not, like, at all. Barely even take note of you as you're walking in. Huh. Interesting. Hmm. Weird. <laughs> so... Errol. Ow! Stop biting me! Errol, <laughs> what uh, what do people do here? What do people do here? Yeah. How do you mean? They live what here. Well, I mean, what do they do? I don't understand how else to ask you that. What do they? What do they do for work? What do, do they do for fun? Seems very. I would assume it's similar to strange. any sort of other town. Yeah, this seems more Ow. cleaner than the one that I came from. A giant light. Sorry, where does the light come from? Good the point. mist. The oh. mist. Sorry, a mist that emits light. Uh, uh, from what I've been told, it's very reflective. Ah. Reflective. Hmm. Maybe if you like. Has anyone ever bottled it up? Oh, that's what I was gonna say. I wouldn't suggest trying. Why would I? What could go wrong? Everything? A lot of things. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Y'all really tried it before. Y'all really gotta be if, more cautious. If someone tells you not to do it, don't do it. But if someone tells me Is not to do it, I'm saying doing that. Someone tells me, yeah, someone tells me not to do it, I'm gonna do it. But someone tells other people to do it, don't do it. Don't do it. Why can I not do it? Because you don't know what you're doing. Exactly. To be fair, I'll never know what I'm doing if I don't do it. Cat folk. Hmm. See, that's a sudden change. You can't expect me to understand that. You're a cat folk. I, I, I wasn't a cat folk yesterday. I've never <sighs> even seen a cat folk before until today. Mm -hmm. Did you not look at a mirror? Yes, I have looked at many mirrors! And images? Videos? Video? Video? What? You guys are weird. <laughs> what, is, what is a video? Video? Um, it's like a, like a, like a picture. 
That mood. A painting? Oh, now you're just fucking that moves. Nice. I'm gonna pull up a video of a cat on my phone, and I'm gonna show it. Video. What cat. in the goddamn... What Did you is... capture a cat in your light box? <laughs> Bless oh, you. Sorry, no, no, no. What the... There's no cat inside of here. How is the cat showing up in... Hmm? It's like a... Uh, Have like you a, drugged like... us, sir? I think you guys have drugged me. I give up. <laughs> Putting it back in my pocket. <laughs> I, need, I, I, just, I need a drink. Where's a place to get a drink here? Uh... A tavern would be a great place to get information. Maybe ah. find a buyer for this machine. <laughs> We're all over Actually... the place, my lord. Actually, you know what? <laughs> After meeting y'all, tavern sounds lovely. Y'all got gold? Of course. All right. Of course. Why would I have gold? Ah, <laughs> right. The penniless one. <laughs> oh, it's not penniless. Maybe I just you can have try a different buy currency. Something with your handkerchiefs. <laughs> I'll, would have. I'll buy you around. Um, do I know where a tavern uh, is near here? Likely. Okay. Earn you my key. Long enough, you might have. To you might probably music. Should. Okay, then I'm I'm Would gonna like take to them one? to the nearest one I know of. All right. <laughs> Would you like to name one, or should I come up with something? Ah, uh, uh, you're the DM. The tavern. And I'm uh, not good at naming things. <laughs> the tavern. It is the it's one, the only. <laughs> simple establishment just called Brent's. Brent's. Brent. <laughs> yep. Very right. simple name of a tavern. Hmm. Yeah, it's uh. Like it's snappy, right to the point. <laughs> uh, if y'all would go ahead, and I might hold open the door for them. Thank you. Thank you. And I walk. I, I walk in. Yes. I make Hello. sure Ben goes in first. <laughs> <laughs> just in case, just in case, you know. In case anything happens, I understand. Yeah. I never go in first. Someone else would be going before me. I'll be answering next, still carrying this contraption in a bag of seeds or whatever it is. Or projectiles. Yep. Either these are very trustworthy or they're just... Okay. I don't know. I'm just gonna walk in. Despite the walls being made of uh, dark wood, uh, it Ooh. is no less bright inside ah. than out. <laughs> God. Ah, I dropped a thing! Wait. Not, a, not a shadow seems to be cast anywhere in the building. <laughs> Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. I'm not sure if I feel sorry for these people or if I if I feel jealous. Welcome. Oh, hello. Good Are day. you friends? Uh, yeah. What? Hi, we're friends. And you own this. And you own this establishment. Indeed. Need something. Hmm. Can I offer you one of my wares? Oh boy. Mm, what is that exactly? <laughs> uh, well, and I'm just gonna. Is there a table nearby? Here yeah. we go again. I'm just gonna drop another <laughs> table. Well, it is a right, fantastic tiny table. <laughs> yes. Goes, goes with the rest of the decor, I guess. Um, <laughs> it is a fantastic contraption that many people have been offering me and begging for, so. I think it might be in your uh, best interest to have one. No, so. What's it do? Calm down. Mm. Don't Can I that. roll? I kind of want to roll like an insight on figure out what he would want. Absolutely, yeah. Okay. Uh, you get four then. Oh, 40. Um, yeah, he's a little bit skeptical of the people he doesn't know being here and offering him stuff. <laughs> What's he look like? Just kind of... Uh, brown hair, brown beard type situation. What's Is his hair look like? In here? Is and he balding in any form? Um, not really, actually. It's, it's pretty pretty effective cover of hair. Just mm -hmm. There goes my idea of... Yeah, uh, hinting at the Alexander to try and sell him a hair uh, product. Mm -hmm. Is there I anyone else right, yeah. in the tavern? Uh, there's. Uh, yeah, there's a guy over there. Just 
hooded figure just kind of hanging out, yeah. facing away from you, hmm. staring at the corner. Oh my god, it's Aragorn. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's Jason Bourne. <laughs> Let's see. I want to I wanna say to him, like, well, obviously, being a business owner yourself and seemingly quite the everyman, wouldn't you like the way to advertise your own business? Uh, suppose. Well, of course you would. See, this box, this contraption will help you with just that. You see, with one small projectile, you can... <laughs> You can, or you pull this lever, and it will fire and ring around to let everyone know that your place is open for business, and will attract many oh. customers this way. So you put like a little, you put like a little, uh, little like advertisement in the projectile, so it shoots, and, and then it shows and everyone and there. What? And what? Step away from the thing. Let the big, pe let the um, adults talk, please. Would I? Would I be ruling persuasion for this, by the way? Sure. All right, trying to persuade him to buy this. <laughs> Well? Oh! Not bad. So wow. flings bean bags then. Yeah, well, bean bags, sure, but we're just wonderful projectiles of this wonderful machine. And it, uh, it makes a very cool noise as well when you do it, which will also alert your customers who are hoping to show up to, or that they are now welcome to show up. Imagine just putting a, like a little, uh, like your little logo, your, your tavern name, and uh, on your little catchphrase right on the little beanbag. Show it out to everybody, and they'll be able to see it. Oh my god, Brent! Ben, are you being paid to do this? <laughs> looks, at, looks, looks at Alexander questioningly. Am I? I will look towards you. No. <laughs> <laughs> this mm. device is terrible. <laughs> <laughs> I just sort of or otherwise, of, what would you like? My hands in front of his weight. Uh, so, um, how much do you have, per, perhaps, in your coffers? <laughs> uh, let's. Uh... What am I being audited now? <laughs> no, 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 no uh, sir. I just want to make sure that I can get this at a correct price and a good uh price for your price range. You see, I am, even though I am, quite a tumble. Or what am I saying? Even though I'm a salesman, I still make to make try to make sure to tailor my prices for the for the customer to make sure everyone can experience my wonderful and absolutely amazing wares. <laughs> well, uh Oh boy. If you'd like, I can give you fifteen gold pieces here and open you a tab with a uh, hundred extra whenever you're back in the area. Gold, of course. I'm gonna lean over to kid. Couch, so I would be coming back here, and that would be meals for quite a few many days, and I have eaten and oh, a little bit, so... That sounds gonna... like a very agreeable price, sir. I'm gonna lean Next over month. to you, Ari, when you hear the price and ask. Get a lot? Yeah, it <laughs> depends. Sounds like a lot for him. Our <laughs> character <laughs> is very poor, so this is actually a very good sale in his eyes. All right. <laughs> I can tell. Right. I'm just watching you like, yeah, this, this one's not, um, uh, he's not rich. He's got nothing. <laughs> it's, probably, it's probably quite a bit for him. Uh, you are given 15 gold coins of various mints, but all the same size. And, <laughs> uh, your name and description is taken down for the uh, tavern to keep note of your uh, ability to pay off with credit. I'm an awesome lean over to you, Ari. With two P's. T-R-A-P-P. -P. I'm going to lean over to you again. I don't think we should come back here after this. I don't think so either. <laughs> well, might as well use um. that credit now, then. <laughs> Yeah, I think drinks are on yes. you, my friend. Yes. Well, that that saves me some effort. Hey, you did I help, help me get my car you out, help. so I will pay for you, Errol. Hmm. Um, I tried then... to help with the sale. <laughs> yeah. And then you did tarnish that after it. Well, that's your <laughs> fault. <laughs> well, if it is my fault, it's not your fault yourself that you were not part of my tab. 
Although we could wipe away that disdain and bury the old hatchet for no. the light box you do carry. No. 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 Eh, eh, worth a shot. <laughs> worth so a I'm gonna shot. turn. And, uh, I'm, I'm gonna turn to the uh, to the the tavern keep then and like, well, um, this guy's not paying for me. Uh, I don't exactly have money, but what I do have oh, is music and musical <laughs> noises. Which I I would I could perform for your patrons in return for some drink. Rabbit, what are you doing? Oh, just. He's like, okay. Um, you seem to be with the group, so I'll I'll just um waive the fee. Huh. So what do you have in the way of uh, meals here? Well, um, pretty standard fare, bread, cheese, variety of beverages. Do you have any meat? Yes. Mm. It's a bit tight on the supply, but, uh, I will take your finest then. Oh. Sure thing. <laughs> At oh, one point, I'm gonna... I'll have a pint. Hmm? <laughs> Mm -hmm. Can I have your strongest beverage, please? Oh, gosh. <laughs> okay, maybe your um, second strongest beverage. There we go. <laughs> Alright, second strongest. That'll save you having to sign the waiver. <laughs> Wait, what? The waiver? I have to sign a waiver for it. Wait, no, no, I changed my mind. I want the strongest I one. Try to say, whoa, no. <laughs> okay. Do you have any fruits, then? Yeah, I'll go with plenty of fruit. Safer. Thank you. Something safe. <laughs> um, <laughs> here is your paperwork, and I'll be back. No, with... I Sorry. Try can I can I look at the paperwork? Up. Yeah. All right. What does it What does it say? Precise or not precise? Uh, exactly. It's basically just a uh, standard liability waiver of Hey, your next of kin can't sue you or sue Brent. Uh, for anything that happens to happen because of your voluntary consumption of this uh, product. He's just giving you straight up <laughs> fucking sure paint thinner, bro. Are you drink that? <laughs> Alexander's just gonna think to himself, hmm, maybe I should are start making these. Are sure you should drink that? That seems a bit... No, I, no what, you do you. I... Yeah, you do you, No, actually. no, actually, I'm gonna have to step in. I, I don't think oh. you should you should get the strongest drink. But if he does that, then I'll get the light box. <laughs> I don't know why y'all should. Did you just assume that you're my next of kin? Light box. <laughs> um. I have my priorities, you know. Um. Right. So. I. Can another question is um due to the differences in worlds here um can I even read it? Uh oh. yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> It seems like the uh, word you, you, that came that you merged with has knowledge of common. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'll pass. <laughs> Maybe next time. All right. Um, so out comes the Brent no, no, person no, no, no. with a couple plates. One has a variety of fruits. Hey. One has a. Uh, meat dish of some sort mm -hmm. um next are oh, oh wait no i have a good idea <laughs> <I changed my bottom. laughs> a glass just no. of pretty standard ale and then uh the next tray that he comes out with has a pitcher of water and a vial of um greenish liquid <laughs> i'm going i i uh... am going to i'm going to sign the paper but I'm gonna sign Alexander Traps on it instead of my own. Oh my god. Oh, just, let them, <laughs> just let them do what they want. Just let them do what they want. <laughs> I, I mean, I'm, I, I'm gonna let them do what they want. Errol is. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> let them, let them um, read the. Let, let them. It's the customer's them. choice. The customer's always right. I am 100% the babysitter right now. 
Yeah, you want I'm the enabler. <laughs> um, I'm the enabler. Do it, do it, do it, do it! Brent goes ahead and transfers the uh, vial and the pitcher of water onto the table and looks at the contract, glances at the two of you, says, Well, who am I to argue with parental consent? And wanders off. <laughs> Errol, like, snorts, like, holds back, like, a full laugh, but, like, snorts and covers his face before he actually laughs. <laughs> uh, and then I he's gonna pick up his fucking, he's gonna pick up his fucking pint and, like, take a chug on it. Fair. I'm gonna take I think a very point, Alexander has checked out as he's precisely trying to eat his meat in a very, uh, proper way, but then as he gets about three bites in, he just goes to what he's actually, him being ravenously hungry and him just tearing it apart. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Alexander had... What sorts of meat has he been able to experience so far? Oh. Uh, pretty much some standard beef. Uh, mostly just standard beef. <laughs> he's never really had meat. He's mostly had just bits of stew. Mm. Of near-expiry meat. Ah. Uh. Right. Sorry, Google. I have not eaten this <laughs> myself. The mystical Google. <laughs> <laughs> Google is the actual god here. Mm. Not sure, Anna. The oracle. Um, this uh, this has a relatively strong texture. Is is what it seems to be. It's interesting. Is he gonna choke? It's not terrible, but uh, I'm. I, this is out of character. I'm gonna guess that I just eat human. <laughs> Probably not. Oh god! like it has a, a strong texture, and you had to Google it. I'm like, hmm. Most people don't know what human tastes like. Yeah. So. Ah, uh, uh, neither did I. You could always ask what it is. True. <laughs> I think Are you that sure you gonna... want to know? So is he, uh, is it, is, I think he'd probably be enjoying it, so I'd go, is this meat? Oh, oh, bear. Okay. Bear? Out of character, did we just eat Grizz? No. <laughs> Grizz? <laughs> Sorry, Grizz, it's been nice knowing you. Oh, no. At least you taste good. <laughs> Seems like an That's what meat, a starving man enjoyable. says, but who knows, who knows? I just go. Yes, yes. Oh, that that makes sense. I I have had bear before. This does this does seem to be very similar to it. Can I roll an insight mm. check on that? <laughs> <laughs> the real question is, do you need to? <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't need to. <laughs> but I don't want to just assume that Errol knows he's lying. <laughs> Like this point, lying, just... <laughs> Welcome back, Legend. Uh, ben is gonna gingerly take a sip. Of of what exactly? The strange green liquid, of course. Are oh, you meant to dilute the rot. green thing? <laughs> huh? Uh... Are you meant to dilute the green thing or no? I don't know. I, just I already took a sip. Oh, so too late. Before, yeah, so, um, right. That is, uh, it, it, it's got a pretty intense onset of flavor. Interesting. Is that, is that a constitution check? It's, uh, it's <laughs> a constitution check. Kind, kind of, kind of spicy. Spicy. Nah. I'm happy with my fruits, thank you very much. Nah, 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 nah. My safe fruits. Delicious stuff. Here, Alexander, your name was on it. You drink it. Nah, I don't like it. What? No. Parental guidance, of I course. Write my name. Parental guidance. Uh, it doesn't matter Parental who wrote it. Your I name was on it. Things ca uh, caretaker. Mm. It doesn't matter who wrote it. Your name was on it. Mm. <laughs> I don't see any obligation here that says I have to drink this, so I will not be partaking in this. Ben doesn't know how to react. Good point. <laughs> Good luck. Um, you win. I mean, you don't have to drink it. 
Alexander is not I'm... very easily pressured. <laughs> yeah. I'm just gonna set it down and yep. casually turn and look at the uh, tavern keep and then look at the what Errol's drinking and then look back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <dear. laughs> Is it a good idea to mix with alcohol? Player without even we had a sip. communication. Still. Without even remotely breaking eye contact, he pushes a glass under a tap that he was standing <laughs> right next to. <laughs> this has happened and before. Over to you. <laughs> yeah. And then he leaves. <laughs> Why was that spicy? Liquid shouldn't be spicy. Why? He's, He's gone. He's um, he just gave you a fucking there. glass of McDonald's Sprite, bro. <laughs> <laughs> With green food, die. It's the uh. Shrugs the... and chugs his drink. Ah! It's the St. Paddy's Day version. <laughs> What's Fair that? Enough. It's a drink. It's ale. I'm so confused. With... Said alert just now. Oh. Oh. Thank you for the donation. Oh, I appreciate yeah. that. You're welcome. That wasn't you. <laughs> I don't know what what you a bit. You're right. You're welcome. You're yeah. welcome. <laughs> ah. <Yeah. laughs> um. Yeah. So he chugs his he chugs his beer. Yeah. Uh, I mean, he's assuming it's beer, and he chugs it, and he just kind of sits there. He's a friendly person, though. And he's gonna, he's gonna, after downing a drink, he's gonna kind of, well, can I, should I do like a, since he just downed a drink, do I need to do like any like constitution check to see if that has already made him tipsy at all? Uh, not mandatorily, but. I'm gonna do it, to I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a roll to see if, if that made him drunk at all or not, because me in real life, I have a really low tolerance. Mm. Yeah, fair enough. So, um, what would I roll, just constitution? Yeah. Okay. And I would honestly think you've become like a cat person. You're probably lighter. Yeah. You, you yeah. probably don't have probably a very yeah. good tolerance. Would, would, it, would I roll constitution regular or like constitution saving throw? Probably just the uh, the stat. Yeah. Okay. Uh, 15. 15. Okay. He's probably not that tipsy, no. Okay. Feeling a little warm, that's all. Yeah, so I'm going <laughs> to walk up to that, that, that figure that you mentioned earlier who's sitting in the corner... Uh, I, I think uh, like I think Errol's like looking down at the table, looks back up, too late seeing seeing him walk <laughs> away, and it's like, oh, god damn it! <laughs> Shouldn't have looked away, Errol. Shouldn't have looked away. So I'm gonna say to this this strange figure like, hey there, uh, I don't know who you are, but. How's it going? I don't really know uh, anyone here, so I figured, you know, they were cool. Might be cool, too. Yeah, uh, yes, the figure hooded uh, mm. turns, the figure parentheses hooded, turns in your direction, and mm -hmm. uh, you see an extremely gecko-y face. Oh. Uh, don't say anything, don't say anything, don't say anything. But then, uh, speaks. Ah. Uh, ah? what brings you here? Uh, I don't know, actually. I kind of showed up. <laughs> so, A common yeah. occurrence. I forgot to put the volume uh, back up. Yeah, um, uh, <laughs> this is very different from where I'm from, so I don't really know anything, so, uh, they're gonna go talk to more people. Maybe more people can tell me things about where, where I'm at and <laughs> what I should be doing right now. You're in a bad place, and you should be keeping your head down. <sighs> should I, should they I then return to the corner. Mm. Um, just chomping on some bear. <laughs> well, you don't seem to want to talk more, so enjoy your mysterious meat. I'm gonna go that way and walk back to the group. Yep. Good choice. Just... And then when I get back, Welcome I'm back. gonna say that guy didn't seem that bad. Uh... How was your talk with the guy? Um, don't, he said not to keep my, wait, what did he 
Keep my head down. Yeah, that. He said that. Are you going to yeah, keep your head just, down? Probably just, not. Just for future reference, and Errol is gonna like kind of drop his voice. Most folk around here don't like you just talking to them out of the blue. Mm. Well, how do people get to know each other? They, they don't. generally don't. How do people sell each other things? How do? You... Yeah, exactly. See, you can't you can't sell and make business without communication. Oh. I can't make cool music without communication. I'm, I ain't talking about that kind of stuff. I'm talking about just randomly walking up and talking to them. Most mm. folk don't like that. Well, how am I supposed to go talk to new people then? If they approach you, then it's still probably not fine, actually. Well, well, yeah. that's that's kind of a bit of a cop out because if you can't go to talk, if I can't go to them, that means they can't come to me, which means no one can come up to me, which I and I can't go to them, so therefore no one ever talks to L each other. Does anyone Keep... have a spare cloth? Why? Uh, <laughs> just, just, just quickly asking, does anyone have a spare cloth? Why? Just I think I get what she's thinking at. Just ask. I'm gonna, I'm gonna step around to the other I, side of Errol. Thank you for the donation, bill legend. Thank you. Me earlier. The five dollar bill. <laughs> yeah, can I handle the five dollar bill he threw me earlier? Sure. Well, I don't think it's enough. We might need a bit more. <laughs> Thanks, yeah, do you have any more of these further. handkerchiefs? Do you have any more of these handkerchiefs in, on you? That's for me to know and for you to find out. Of course. I think that's why she's asking. <laughs> well, right now, we're keeping it to me, no one. Can I pick bucket him, DM? Uh, interesting <laughs> You're, like, question. in front of me talking to me. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's... Well, would I roll against that? Why would I do it under? Well, generally... Situations that involve pickpocketing are a sleight of hand roll on the part of the person doing it and a uh, perception. Would be like perception? Yeah. Okay. To yeah. avoid having it happen. However, as mentioned, it is up to the players involved when this sort of thing arises between players. So. Yeah. That seems very fair to me. I don't like the Granted, roll. I, but I, I still caught it. <laughs> 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 Perception too, it. imagining of that. <laughs> so I'm oh, going to again. Versus slide of hand, what, what, six? Is that that is six? a God. 16 feet by a 17. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just, I'm gonna like grab her wrist. And be like, what do you think you're doing? Trying to get to the light box. Well, I don't want you to do that. I lost my thingy. That's okay. I'll find it later. <laughs> I dropped the thing. I definitely mm, nice. didn't just do similarly. Oh. <laughs> oh well, I'll try again. But I do want to know, I still do want that light box though. Um, well, considering you just tried to steal it, I, I, I don't think I, I might want to be letting you see it anytime soon. Well, that's fine. I don't have to see it to take it. That's a fair I argument. I can't really argue that, but still, I, I don't. I don't. I would. I'm gonna try to not let that happen. Mm -hmm. You do that. Mm -hmm. I'm beginning to think that hooded figure is a better companion. Don't. <laughs> Why? Do you know him? No, I'm just don't. Don't bother people you don't know. It could get you in real big trouble. I already consider myself in quite big trouble right now. <laughs> and even yes, worse. I consider that too. <laughs> he is currently holding on to something that both me and her and points at the cat once. <laughs> I really don't understand y'all's captivation with that thing. <laughs> it's a shiny thing. I must have it. I don't understand your not captivation with it. Yes. It is yeah. Hold. Mm, mm, mm. I just don't see any Light use dog. for it. It doesn't need to have a use. I, I mean, if it ain't practical, what's the point of it? I like the way you think. It looks but rare. But someone will buy it. Mm, I, I must have it. It looks rare. I'm going to reach into my pocket. 
I'm gonna pull out a quarter. Oh. Just and a quarter. I go, quarter. Very, sh very shiny quarter, though. It's more like a fresh off the mint quarter. Ah, That's so you so do cool. have coin. You have money. <laughs> That's actual money. <laughs> what? How are you trying to give us around? a handkerchief for? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> but that what was worth this? more than this. <laughs> No, that's what. So I think this is probably worth maybe, I don't know, less than whatever you're holding. Well, what's this worth then? A lot more. Cavern keep. What's this worth? Eh. It looks like a silver piece. This isn't it's silver. Like, it's like, like platinum or something. What is a quarter made out of? <laughs> nickel. <laughs> Ironically. Nickel. Oh, they'll say it's made out of nickels. <laughs> Hilarious. Stop clicking. Ow, ow! <laughs> Unless it's a I really old quarter. What oh, do you mean how many things do I have in my pockets? Ouch, I have the wallet with these, these like, uh, real-world money in it. I have my melodica, and I had the phone. That's all I have. Excuse me. Melodica. Melodica. Yeah. What is a Melodica. A lot of, it's like that a, you instrument know what, thingy. He was playing yeah, on the way instrument. here. Yeah, it's you know what a oh. harmonica is. Thank you for donation, legendary nightmare, and hello, yes, my PayPal. Thank you. Um, <laughs> <laughs> gonna mute my phone a bit. Well, you blow air in, <laughs> and you hit keys. <laughs> noise happen. So <laughs> quick. So uh. quick. Oh, with the keyboard. I see. Do you think that would sell well? It is a small piano. Could make quite a bit of money. Hmm. Not for you. I keep my eye on us. <laughs> no, I don't have anything to trade, so it's not like I can buy it. Yeah, you have nothing that... for. There is nothing that you could trade trade for it. Money. Can can I actually no can I can I call for a quick break? I gotta use the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. Okie dokie, I heard a choke. Small recess. Uh, I am going to fill a cup of a water during that time. I, I'll be I will go back. get a beverage as well then. You guys are not prepared. Your I've got ears. water and I've got snacks. I, I was prepared. I just finished it all. So I have oh, to go God. get more. All right. Dude. I love how comfy collabs is like. I will like, take the chance as well. Getting it oh, on and all. What do you mean, oh, getting on and off? No, no, it's like, um, uh, notifying that I'm streaming, and then it turns off, and then it turns back on, saying that I'm streaming, like, yeah, have fun trying to connect with the YouTube stuff, because that's hard I... to... <laughs> I thought it was really funny that it only told everyone that I was streaming right when I went off starting soon. I don't mm. know how. <laughs> I have that mute to You have mute I, I... I just obsessively look at uh, Discord channels, even in Discords I'm not like oh, particularly interested in. So I don't. I have like a I lot. I just need that more really and more information. And I never look at them. Yeah, I haven't muted because it keeps. There's too many pings. Like I'm not watching everyone though. Yep, and I'm not live anymore. So it says. <laughs> I'm gonna fight them. I can't understand people who have like t like 20 Discord servers and each one of them has a little white bubble next to it. I'm like, how? Mm. How are you able to uh, do that? How I are you have, okay like... with that? I have 30 of them in at least, well, that I uh, somewhat in, and um, every single one of them except for like three has those little bubbles on them, and at least half of them have some form of red number on them. Oh gosh. Red numbers are even more despicable to not check. Because like, mm. I get overwhelmed by how much there is, yeah, mm. so I gave up and I only check whatever one I'm specifically interested in looking at at that moment. I'm gonna check my other discords. <laughs> and then, um... I'm just playing Tetris while waiting. Nah, I think I'm so. in my kitchen right now, so... <laughs> oh, do you have wireless headphones? Yar. I've gotten too into speaking the way that I've been speaking, so I just went, do you have wireless headphones? <laughs> what? Do you have wireless headphones? I love I use it. it takes a little bit to get into character. Headphones. Once I get in, I'm just kind of stuck for a bit. I just love the fact that Yu still has not introduced herself at all. She's been making mm -hmm. sure nobody pays attention to that fact. Part of me, I, I don't think uh, Alexander would have paid attention. Part of me would have been like, if you give me your name, I'll let you on the tab. 
for force death. But yeah. Alexander is more, uh, You're hungry. It, more Alexander's concerned hungry with his right own. Now. Well, that, and he's more concerned with his own name. Mm. Making sure I everyone just... knows it. I just really enjoy played inept characters. I'm just having fun bullying <laughs> and, like, people. like naive characters. <laughs> I can't believe my sleight of hand failed though. <laughs> By That's, one. I... What deception? Oh, it was the first deception I had that I immediately failed. <laughs> I caught it out. I was like, you're gonna get a two. No, not deception, strength. Oh, it was a strength? Oh, it was strength. Yeah. Like, you're gonna get a two yeah. for that. And then, like, you got a three. You're like, um, I'm just, sorry. I, I, I didn't. I got like two, like, 20 somethings in a row and then immediately <laughs> get a two. Remember, D&D cool &D logic game. is when you are doing yeah. useless things that don't really matter is when you get a 20, and then when you mm. actually are doing something important is when you roll a 1. Mm. <laughs> I just roll shit most of the times. How did the drink I just opened up go? Did I, I not grab one I have a dice set on me. Mm. You have a what? I've got a dice set on me. Huh. Oh, because you're a rogue, um, right? Yeah, I was given- I have quite a few things on my person. They're all heavy. Oh, for thief, I think. Yeah. Uh, for rogue, rogue. Oh, no. quite a few things. Yeah, it was rogue I just... or criminal. But whatever I personally one don't like. I think the criminal gives you the dice set. Ooh. Mm, yeah. Um, Ooh. I have a criminal background. That's why. You have acquired water. Good, 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 good. <sighs> I have acquired. Wait, my... she came with the game plan. I like her focus and on target. I'm guessing you're talking about you, you there. You didn't get your microwave before it made that beep noise. Still disappointed. I was trying to find a fork. I'm sorry. Failed you. I will pop. Forks go in the microwave. What? Forks go in the microwave, don't you know? <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Perfect, My character perfect. might not be that smart, but I am definitely not that stupid. We'll see. And says I'm not that stupid. I never, never went out of my way to say that I'm not stupid. It's not that. Stupid. Oh, I did already grab a Coke, and I already brought it back to my room, so now I have two. Oh my god. Special well, awareness, you got stuff. One of them didn't get open, so it's okay. Save it for Rolling low on perception here. <laughs> no. I was rolling oh, low on memory, because I... This thing already. Well, already is on a check, from what I know. Oh, memory. Oh, that was history. I have Maybe, like, memory. a will check? I don't know. Oh, that be history. Go, 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 yes, go, the history go, go, of the last go, five minutes. It still is. <laughs> yeah, brief I haven't like. One could say. I haven't fully like dialed in on no. how I want his character to be. I just really enjoyed having the like being meme about it until I like he slowly develops into a proper character. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I wanted to talk to a bunch of the red NPCs, but I'm like, I don't have anything to sell, so I don't have any reason to talk to them. <laughs> <laughs> but I definitely yeah, will. Uh, just over there. As we play more, I'll get yeah. more serious with. But I can't take everything really with me, but I figured the the most expensive thing in it at the moment would be this the thing. uh yeah the the weird the projectile contraption that is definitely pew, pew. not some sort of gun. <laughs> not a gun. Wait. Not a gun. Wait, wait, wait. Basically... Why have Why have not thought about check if you guys? It seems like it might be a gun using my modern era knowledge to be able to see tell if I can tell us a gun or not. I don't know. It's what a what you mean. Mean. Yeah, huh? there's a beanbag launcher. Yeah. I would have totally known that as someone from the modern era. Why I didn't even... I You're forgot that that's I mean, that's, you It just kind of looks like a steampunk projector. You're panicking. You're a cat boy yeah. now. That's true. That's fair. <laughs> You're a cat boy now. Was that a self-help book title? <laughs> so. <laughs> so, you messed up. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Whatever the uh the so now my character Steve is convinced Rogers that a is. beanbag gun is a musical instrument. Nice. Oh yeah. Nice. Mm -hmm. I mean, in a sense, you can be considered the sound of the, the bang from it shooting and then the sound of the beanbag hitting are two separate notes. Well, now I just got to use the. Uh, I rolled a of check them. so hard it's actually working in real life now. I, mm -hmm. I I'm pretty sure I've seen someone play the uh, Super Mario theme on Glock. See? So you can do it with a gun, you can do it with a beanbag gun. It might my be friends very used um, to do, um, unreasonable. In games, gun syncs for various songs, so yeah. Mm. Guns are music. 
anything not their intended purpose, but instrument. I kind of want to make him into one of those characters that finds a way to make any and everything in some form of musical instrument or musical place thing. Mm. Wow, animals are expensive. Hmm? What? <laughs> Gets, and during I'm a flex, buying an animal right now? No, I've huh? got the player's handbook open. I'm looking at oh. what you can yeah, use to get that cart moving. <laughs> you could afford a mule favorite, or a donkey. My favorite thing that I saw is that I heard that a well, yeah, I probably should have waited to... Uh, so, well, no, I have, I have 25 gold. And you just got 15 real 15, gold. yeah. Virtual yeah, well, yeah, that's what I mean. I had a. Uh, yep, yep, I have yep. 25 now. I had 10 before. 25 total, mm. yeah. Oh, so you can afford a, a Mastiff, which is not going to pull your cart. That's a type uh, of dog. I ain't giving you dog. any money, so. Um, also, um. I'll find a way to make some. I as long as I honestly. As long as I find a bunch of random stuff, I can maybe barter my way through I and <laughs> maybe get enough money for stuff. Yeah, I probably should have kept that handkerchief and sold it. Uh, I have it now. Use so. music as a <laughs> I didn't think about it. It's mine now. Afford a mule. Um, mule will probably do yeah. it. So, it so at least good. get your cart moving. Hmm. How are are my way. quarters going to be accepted as currents in, in in game? Probably a silver, if anything. Mm. Okay. And how many would I have? Then. Uh, how, how many would you normally have? Changed as a musician. Happen to carry? Probably not a lot. It depends. Actually, it, it depends. Vending machine. If I'm if I'm a street performer, I probably would have a lot. Are you a street Actually performer? A band? You seem to have a venue. Yeah. I do have a venue. I do have a band, but but doesn't it normally go into a card you... or something? Um. Where do you? So I'm gonna get... say he has coming? five silver. <laughs> Yeah, oh, five yeah. quarters, and that's all he has to his name. <laughs> okay, make that note. Pop it into your character singing so you remember. Yeah, that works. Five. Yep, you've got five silver. <laughs> I'm so rich. Sure. Yeah. What's this, what's EP again? I can't remember what uh, it was. Electrum. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, that's like isn't it like super basic, rare isn't shit. Like, it's isn't uh, like. So, Electrum is a real metal. It's an alloy of gold and silver, which is why it's exactly between their value in ah, currency. Okay. Welcome back, Legend. Thank you for showing all of them love. Oi. I'm back! Welcome, Welcome back! back. And my chat uh -huh. says, Y'all are precious and I love listening to y'all. I love <laughs> you too, chat. I love you! <laughs> Toss a coin to your kitty, oh people of plenty. I will. That's <laughs> what be most cat boy you could be fifth edition. The cattest and the boyest. How to how to, me. how to succeed in cat boy without really trying. Well, I can assure you I'm not really trying. <laughs> so where were we? Um, yes. every, um we're free to resume if everyone's around ready. The table, yeah. <laughs> Okay. I'm numbing on fruit, because it is delicious. Nom. Yum, 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 yum. Yep. So, um, we made it to town. Mm. We got some nice drinks. Mm. That's sure. What are we supposed to do next? Sure. Just wander around aimlessly? Try not to get lost? Well, y'all should probably figure out some kind of lodgings. Well, Tavern no, keep. the B A R and M. I mean, the rooftops don't seem too bad. Well, the tavern keeps going to be a bit distracted in a second because as the group of you are just hanging out, you know, enjoying what vibing. you've ordered, um, another person is going to enter the establishment. Oh, is he cool? Yeah, and uh, he's sort of a not exactly pleasant looking figure, rather hollow facial expression. Um, wearing a robe that appears to have a rib cage sewn into it. Disconcerting. Mm. Um, and, uh, just sort of long gray hair. And, uh, very much not long facial hair. Almost stubble. Doesn't seem to pay much attention to keeping that, uh, well kept. And just... Anyone who catches a glimpse of this guy's face, there's 
one thing that you've seen so far that doesn't seem to reflect any light, and it is this man's eyes. Ooh. Errol, uh, you know who this is. It's King Tristan. Oh, shit. Um, <laughs> um, that's a big bad guy. Uh, it's a I, guy. Big er sad guy right now is what it sounds. Errol, like, like the moment he walks in, like, kind of, like, ducks his head. Um, and then mm -hmm. motions for the others to, to do so as well. And just kind of whispers, that's King Tristan. Keep your head down. I'm gonna, okay. I'm gonna... Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't even so why are... think about it. I, why, though? I won't do it. Just tell me why. What's so bad about him? Don't. If Errol um... says no, then no. <laughs> just want to know why. But surely royalty shall be inviting him. Yeah. Not always. Brent has He doesn't Brent has look very rich. He looks he looks less rich than you. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, yeah, yes. And he raises his voice. You, you you shut, shut, up. Up. shut up, shut up, shut up. <laughs> um, <laughs> as the four of you nothing, have this nothing. whispered conversation, uh, Tristan was approaching <laughs> you <going> already. <laughs> <laughs> am I aware? So, um, am I aware that he's noticing him coming directly mm -hmm. towards us? I mean, anyone who's not busy bowing and staring at the floor would be plenty okay. aware. I think I think it's too late to hide from him. I want to try to talk to him. We can't get out of it anyways. Nope. Hey, how's it going? You are. Uh, oh, I've been you told like that music? you are a fellow by the name of King Tristan. I oh. myself am Alexander Trapp. A world-renowned salesman and creator of many useful and helpful tonics and devices. Say, Errol? which? Errol, the doors over there. Can we can we just slip and let, leave these two alone, please? <laughs> <laughs> oh. You um, three are new, yeah. Yeah, I just got here. Hi. Yes, you did just get yeah. here. Yeah. Uh, well, you want a drink? Interesting. So how about? Oh, it's I'll being handled. I'll leave you handled. here with a nice drink. Uh, what's being handled? Uh, Brent comes out with a golden chalice and sets it on the desk, or the bar, whatever. Uh, King Tristan just uh, leaned past you to pick it up. I'm gonna lean out of his way, kinda like motion, motion him past me, and I'm like, so, uh, why, why, what brings you to come to talk to us? Well, uh, I tend to take an interest when new people show up. After all, I have to be aware of what's happening in my kingdom. Oh, this is your Excuse kingdom. You, is that golden chalice made specifically for you? Oh god, they're still talking. It's actually uh, something that I've lent to the bar. I come here every so often, after all. Out of curiosity, how much would that cost? <laughs> hmm. I don't think he's going to sell it to you. This was uh, my grandfather's. What's Grandfather must be a wonderful house? man. Grandfather's father. Family is very much uh, not a entirely important. I'm just trying to like downplay how <laughs> how expensive. Oh, no. It is. no! I don't know them. Errol <laughs> Errol <laughs> <laughs> is like Errol is fixing is Alexander with just like the worst stare like possible, just like <laughs> like. Desperately trying to convey that he needs to shut up with only he his eyes. Put up, head down, <laughs> just leading the bruise. Like I don't know these people anymore. I'm not affiliated with them. Um, I'm just happy to be here. So, so, oh. Mister, Mister, uh, Sir, Your Majesty, King Tristan, uh, uh, do you like music? Um, but I, I, I think he would like to speak. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> oh yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Shush. Yes, well... By all means, if you'd like to play something. He just sort of oh. looks at the melodical player expectantly I and begins to sip from the chalice. To, I'm going to roll a performance check, and I hope it's good. Yes, you good are. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god! Dirty 
a 20. Hey, nice. Yeah, I'm not a musician in real life, okay? <laughs> it's much better in character. <laughs> mm -hmm. Much better uh, in character. <laughs> King Tristan uh, sort of dons a uh, bit of a thin smile, oh. passing the empty goblet back to Brent. Mm -hmm. That's certainly unlike much that I've ever heard before. I try to spice then. things up, keep things fresh. Um, he reaches into his uh, weird cloak with the bones sewn into it and uh, withdraws a deck of cards. <gasps> oh, I have a bad experience in D&D with decks of cards. <laughs> he, oh, well, you were gambler, sir? What's that? What was that? What did he say? I said, what? I said, oh, are you a gambler, sir? Oh. <laughs> Aren't we all in a manner of speaking? He cuts the deck and um, takes the top three cards off of it before returning the rest to the cloak. Card deck? What kind of, kind of card game is this? Magic. Uh, it's not so much a game as a way of like... getting to know people. Oh, is it tarot? Uh, well, clearly you already know me myself, I, as I am Alexander Trapp, the most world-renowned <laughs> salesman. <laughs> well, uh, Errol is once again certainly. giving that same stare to Alexander. <laughs> I'm sure you're used to your reputation preceding you, in which case this won't be anything out of the ordinary. He flips the first card over. Sort of oh. nods. Flips the second, looks at it. Breathes a is bit of a sigh of relief. Is and he flipping flips it in a way that we can see them? Um, yes. I'm looking very expectantly at them as he flips them. Like, leaning over to mm -hmm. see better. I'm not All leaning right. over. <laughs> I will put them into Discord. Discord, oh. Discord. Uh... I don't... Oh. Um, upon flipping the third card over, the uh, amusement and relief from the past minute or so of conversation evaporates instantaneously. And he just kind of goes still, holding the three cards. Uh, are those cards bad? I'm gonna are you all right? It's going to be an interesting few days. He tucks the three cards back into his cloak, turns slowly, and walks out of the tavern. Did he leave know what cards the mean? golden goblet? He yeah, gave it back Brent. to Brent. He gave, he gave it to Brent. Brent. It... Brent, how much do you want for that goblet? You don't. <laughs> I don't think that's a good idea. I mean, I know I've made a lot of bad ideas so far, so me saying that... To give a little bit of insight on why I'm trying to buy it so much, it is because in Alexander's head, no one could ever argue that he is not rich if he drinks from a, a goblet like that. Uh, <laughs> fair. It's yeah, fair, fair, fair. Um, in response to how much for the goblet, Brent is simply going to say, yeah, I'm not going to put a price on my own head. Ah. Uh. Before turning back to what he was doing before. <laughs> I'm sure your head would be priced rather highly. You've got a nice head there. I'm not asking for a price on heads. I'm asking for a price on goblet, obviously. Oh, he's gosh. He's saying if he tried to sell it to you, he'd basically be signing his own death warrant. Yep. That's why you don't mess with royal stuff. Um, How do you, oh, it, you don't look at it, you leave it. For the record, yes. uh, Cat, Girl, and, and Errol, um, you know, I was trying to talk and distract him long enough for you guys to sneak out. You guys are clearly uncomfortable. 
<laughs> Errol said I wasn't allowed to sneak out. <laughs> it's it's well, best. I did my part. It, it it was it's best not to upset him. Oh. <laughs> See, that's why I tried to make him my friend. If he's so big and powerful, I'd rather have him on my side. <laughs> I don't know if he's very, uh, susceptible to your kind of friendship making. I mean, he seemed to enjoy my music. Uh, that yes, he did. He enjoys a strong butt. Oh. And he, he even asked of his own accord. I only asked him if he liked music. I didn't ask him if he wanted me to perform for him. He did ask himself. Fair enough. You might be right there. Hmm. I think he might like me more than he likes all three of you. That's fine. Well, let's not get a little bit hasty. There is no one that anyone could like more than Alexander Trapp, the most world-renowned salesman. Uh -huh. I already like the two of them better than you, so... Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Believe me, the feeling is mutual. <laughs> Good. <laughs> that laughter is in character as well, too. Wow. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> yep. So, um... So, um, what now? That's King Tristan. <laughs> just thought he'd stop by. Wow. Oh, he just stop by. We're not special. So, uh, who exactly is that King Tristan, anyway? He's... I mean, I, I, I feel it's the king, so yeah. he must be a big deal, but... Does he have a castle? Yes, there's a literal castle outside. Could have been anyone's castle. You s Who else would- Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I know, that's your oh, house. Gosh. It ain't. <laughs> uh, well. What time is it? Game Good of the game. Good question. Oh, yeah, does, does time move in this dimension? It's a good question. It? I just know that it's very bright out. Very bright out? I'm gonna uh, guess no, then. Most people woke up about mm, four-ish hours ago. So it's like noon-ish. Morning. Yeah, it's mid-morning. <laughs> mid-morning. <laughs> people are waking up four hours ago. They're not my sleep time in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, well, what other cool places are there, Miss, Mr. Tour Guide, Errol Guy? Mr. Shifter? Sorry, could you re repeat that? <laughs> what else is there to do here besides sit in a tavern and get drunk all day? You, you mean you get drunk? I mean, I, I'm not the only one drinking right now. Well, I'm... We're I'm, cat folk. What does that have to do with anything? <sighs> you'll learn it. You'll learn it. You'll learn it, I ain't... Um, you'll learn it. Sink or swim. Anyways. Is there... Uh... What? Well... What a place I, of books. Do you want... Did you say books? Books, yes. Hmm. Sure, it would be helpful for me to actually know about where I'm at if I could read some books about it. Would there be a fee to go inside a library? Probably not. Some places have. Some places. Some I even know where floor. I came from has. Does this place even have a library? There is a library. Does this library charge for admission? It does it not. Well, I can... guess I could take you there. Thank you. Uh, y'all uh... two are free to come as well. I'd prefer not to leave y'all alone, but of course I can't stop you if you want to wander off. Uh... I do want to perhaps uh, look for some sort of stable or something. Something I could use to get my cart down to the rest of the city. Well, we could... There's something like that on the way. Yeah, probably something like that on the way. 
So we head there. It's bad idea to leave you alone anyways. <laughs> I don't believe I ever caught your name. Hmm? Um... Yes, that one's well... Finn. That's Errol. I'm Alexander Trappin. Exactly are you. Mm, Cat lady. Yeah, you. You, you? Hmm. You, you is fine. You, you will do. Cute. You, you. All right. Hmm. You, you have to show? Can we leave Ben here? <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, uh, Ben's the one that wanted to see the library. I see. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, come on then. <laughs> Against Ben's, you know, no way, you know what? Uh, Ben's gonna cast a spell. What? What spell? He's not gonna do magic. He's not gonna do that. Do you know how to purpose. use magic? No, okay, no, he's 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 gonna laugh so hard. I'm always gonna kick joke, him off the island. That it's gonna <laughs> cast the uh, the heretic laughter, and that's how he's gonna learn about magic. The what laughter? Uh, hideous laughter. laughter. Oh, Tasha's yeah, hideous, hideous laughter. You're gonna cast Tasha's hideous laughter? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Where is it? Can't find oh, spells. Is it? Is it on your spell it list? Is. Yeah, happy I have birthday. it. Yep. I support you, Leslie. Happy birthday, Leslie. Happy there. birthday. Happy birthday, um, Leslie. I don't, I don't know, know how to roll said, to cast may it. May he get a happy birthday. So happy birthday. Uh, you don't have to roll to cast it. The oh, first thing. Affected oh. has to roll to not get casted on. Mm. Um, well, I'm laughing so hard that I don't have anyone in specific that it's targeted at, so I don't. I can. Did he target it. himself by accident? Did you already laugh? Ah, happy birthday then, Leslie! Happy birthday! I'm gonna. Can I just like? I don't know. Like, I don't know if you want to choose, or maybe I can like roll to see who in the vicinity it could be affected by, whether uh, it's a player character or a, or a. Or an oh. NPC. Um, I'll have it hit this NPC. Oh God! <laughs> Thirty feet away. <laughs> is no? Is it? Are we still in the tavern, or are we in the streets now? We're in the tavern. We haven't oh, moved. Yeah. We're in the tavern. So it would, be, it would be. It would. It would be either guy. the lizard guy or the tavern keeper. Uh, yeah. Sure. Uh, wow. Can I have it well, be a uh, lizard guy? Because it'd be that's funny. That's actually who I was having it be as well. So. Ah. <laughs> um, as Ben has uh, mentioned Yu Yu Hakusho, which nobody <laughs> else has ever heard of. <laughs> um, he laughs, and uh, eventually the lizard in the corner starts laughing along. <laughs> so hard, in fact, that the hooded figure falls from their seat. Ah. Just... <laughs> oh, <no>. uh... <laughs> uh... <laughs> They're not gonna stop, are they? Oh, okay, <laughs> all right, come on. Um, uh, he's, uh, one, I think he's gonna put a copper piece down on the table for a tip, and then two, he's going to half pick up Ben and start pushing him out the door. <laughs> hey, we're going. That'll work. <laughs> Bye, lizard guy. <laughs> Bye. Bye, Brad. The door closes behind you. <laughs> That didn't go as bad Maybe the alcohol he drank had a little bit more effect on him than he thought. <laughs> <Perhaps>. <laughs> the temperature is a bit higher than it should be. No. Um, then the question, could, my other question for you, Nidia, is the end, is um, does he realize that he casted magic? Is there some feeling of like knowing that he casted magic? Um. Ooh, good. I, good one. Sort of like uh, well, it's interesting, right? Because. Mm -hmm. You you definitely are. Like there, there's there's a sensation I I available, but you did drink the single most suspicious thing you've ever seen. <laughs> like <laughs> to be fair, half an hour ago. <laughs> to be fair, oh I only had a very small sip of it. Yeah, yeah, also yeah but it was oh. also in a tiny <laughs> vial, so I'm assuming yeah. a very small sip was still extremely potent. <laughs> can I like no, keep lore, that? Can I like lore rise explain that that sip of that weird? Action is what made him able to cast magic and what gave him his, the, the magic ability that he has. Sure. <laughs> that oh, wait, did you say, did, did anyone keep that? Yeah. 
I set it on the table. I and I left it there. I didn't. I, like I it. don't think anybody picked it up. Nope. No. I probably should have taken it. Shut up. You can go back and grab it. Eh, it wouldn't make sense now. Hmm. All right. My one other. Th Whatever. Would it be like maybe like a like a some form of like isn't there something related to like arc would I be able to do like an arcana check to be able to see if he realizes that he just cast magic? Um yeah, you can roll the arcana skill. <laughs> see what happens. Twelve. Twelve. Uh, you're pretty new at this whole uh not being on Earth thing sorry not earth it's a it's a world very similar to earth with no <laughs> yes copyright. very similar it's earth no h yeah <laughs> er <laughs> okay so kind of like say that like he he might have realized that something was a off but had like kind of brush it off yeah like all a right. lot of weird stuff's been happening today mm -hmm. all right <laughs> you're a cat <laughs> yeah, that's, that's that's the more pressing change. That's yeah. the more like urgent, catching your attention type situation. Yeah, the cat folks not gonna teach him anything. He's Fair. Learn. He's gonna learn. He's gonna fail. <laughs> um. So there is a small stable area, uh, reasonably on route to the library. Mm. If you guys want to stop there first. I would appreciate it. Yeah, let's let's do that. Nice. Do we have enough? Mo do you have enough money to get whatever? To try to. Get I can whatever. find my way around it. Sure. You do that. Oh. Uh, yeah. So, uh, just generic tiefling person uh, shows up to attend to you. Uh, good evening. Hello. What kind of uh? Let me explain my situation a little bit. I, myself, Alexander Trapp, am a world-renowned salesman in my cart that would bring many very good wares and uh, goods to your town. Currently seems to be stuck on top of a hill, and I have no way of getting it through cliff. here. Or cliff. Yes, cliff. Sorry. I'm only um, pointing everything. <laughs> uh, so you need something carriage drawing type? Yes, precisely. All right, well, got some of those over there. Some of those, yes. What specifically? <laughs> got the, uh, got this gray one. He pats like a donkey. And, <laughs> uh, we got Bill. And he points over at a very flat-faced mule. Huh. Yeah, I'm not sure, not sure where he came from, but... Bill. <laughs> Bill. Ah. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, is it J just the two, then? Uh, as far as stuff that can, you know, transport. I, uh, can I roll an investigation to try and figure out which one of the, one of the two mules is better? Sure, there's a mule and the donkey. Would that be nature or would it be nature? Damn, try to get an investigation because I have that. Let's see. That's 10. Uh, well, uh, I mean, one, one of them looks thousand. normal. <laughs> one of them is not Bill. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's what this is, alright? Alright. Um, so, how much for them? Both? For either one. Well, uh, grey dude, probably around six of the round yellow things. Uh, Bill just gotta convince him, really. <laughs> <laughs> Do you mean... What? I'm sorry, convince him? What? Yeah. He's not, he's not like mine. He just, he's there. Mm. <laughs> I have a... Uh... Payments or free? <laughs> um, the free choice seems a bit uh tough to handle. Hmm. But to convince. It did... What can you tell me about Bill? <laughs> oh god. Well, uh so I was, you know, paying attention to the animals and then um I sorta 
noticed that uh, Bill was there, and then um, he just he, he didn't leave. Hey. <laughs> 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 I, I think understandably I'm having trouble understanding this. So he just is he he just doesn't want to leave. And he's not owned by anyone? I don't know what he right. wants, but he hasn't left. Does it, about right. does it, That's what's does it look like a normal like mule or <laughs> No. It, it's its head is like Flat. half as long as it's supposed to be. Uh -huh. from, So it's like it ran into back. a wall? Uh. Yeah. Can I Whatever. try and like persuade the uh can I try and persuade Bill um <laughs> to follow me handling. somehow? Charisma. <laughs> no, yeah. be... Wouldn't that be an animal handling check? Uh so it will be the animal handling skill, but it will God also damn. be a charisma check. Okay, oh, so which one do I double, roll first? Maybe a double. Well, um, it's, it's the same thing. It is a charisma check that adds proficiency if you know animal handling. Mm. Oh, okay. Well, does he know animal handling then? Yeah, I are you proficient animal with animal handling? animal handling? I'm not proficient, no. Okay, so then it's just a charisma check? Mm. Hell yeah, um, I can do that. Whatever see, animal please is please furthest good, please in please the corner by itself. Oh! oh. Nice. Wow! wow. Alright, Bill's moving. Yeah. You just kind of sidle up to this thing, and uh, Bill makes eye contact, nods at you. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck what is want? this thing? You don't question Bill. <laughs> Bill does whatever he wants. <laughs> can I roll like? I have... Can I roll like nature to see if I know what the fuck Bill is? <laughs> yeah. The 14. <laughs> uh, I mean, it should be a mule. <laughs> it be I was like, oh, you just go, it's Bill. That's, that's, that's the cool. general category that you would have Bill to play. Bill is his own in. species. Uh, oh, um, we made a powerful uh, friend. It's Bill? Bill. I guess you're coming with me. Whatever. During again. this. During this whole experience, Ben is just in I the corner with like whatever animals in the corner. Um, yep, you find a strange purplish bird. Uh, I'm, and I'm just petting this strange purplish bird the whole entire time, completely ignoring everything else that's going around me. Can we mm -hmm. leave him here? <laughs> uh, well, this is a place for animals. <laughs> I would feel bad if something happened to him. Bad for the bird? Um, I bad guess. for the bird. Yeah, but. Bird. Yeah, Ben! Uh, oh, uh, what are you doing uh, back there? Uh, there's a bird! Don't mess with that. Looks... I haven't seen one of these before. Yeah, no, no, it's, it's dead. Leave it alone. What yeah. is oh. <laughs> it? Dead? Put that thing down and come on! <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was just asleep. Ah, ew. I don't want to oh, be here anymore. I don't want to be here anymore. I don't want to be here anymore. I don't want to be here anymore. Oh god. Come on. Such strange things. I don't want to hear things about not messing with strange things from the man who makes his living off of strange things. Mm, he does own a, that. well, used to own a bill. I, I think he said he didn't Wait. own bill. Bill just kind of did what he wants. <laughs> yeah, pretty oh. much. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> Well, we have a Bill as a companion now. <laughs> we got Bill. Yep. <laughs> right, I mean, just wants to right. put in my item list. So it's just like, fuse tools, daggers, cane sword, Bill. <laughs> Bill. Bill. <laughs> Bill. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Welcome to the horror game, guys. This is uh, going well. <laughs> very um, scary so far. You, you <laughs> gotta get used to the characters before you can start building tension. 
Yeah, yeah. No, yeah. no, I'm, I'm, I know, I'm joking. <laughs> no, I, I know, I know, I was joking with you. <laughs> oh my god, okay, I guess, are we heading to the library? Actually, it's almost 11, should we wrap soon? Honestly, yeah, we can we can visit the library next time. We have Bill now. We got Bill yeah, now. Bill is all we need. This is a very Yeah, we have this is very, very successful session, I would say. Absolutely. <laughs> Acquired <have> Bill. Bill. <laughs> yeah. I added him to my notes under allies of the party and everything. Bill. 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 In our time yep. of need. I love the idea of Bill in parentheses, Bill. <laughs> Bill is Bill. I, Bill is Bill. I, why did I imagine that, like, like a smash, like, screen, like... <laughs> <laughs> Instead of having a tagline, it's just Bill. 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 <laughs> Bill. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. I love Bill. Bill is my favorite companion now. <laughs> All right. Well, I had a really good time, you guys. <laughs> so I. I had a I'm fun glad time this went as well. well. As it did. Mm, yeah. I do. I am too. I hope. I hope Eggie can join us next session. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And you can be in the library. Yep. Heck Already yeah. there. Mm -hmm. yeah, Waiting. Yeah. Plotting. <laughs> what is what is Eggie? Oh, Eggie's the satyr, isn't she? Yeah. Yep. She's a fellow yeah. bard. Bard. Yeah. You're better bard than this bard. Hey, you know what? I did really good on my performance check. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> he actually did. <laughs> so. Just for one time. The next time we do it, then. Um... Yeah, Dirty Twenty is it's... pretty fucking good. Hmm. We had actually quite a few good rolls today, huh? Yeah. Surprisingly, I'm not usually this lucky. Yeah, especially with roll twenty, I I've had bad luck with roll twenty's rolls in the past. Maybe it's just in oh. this session though. Then the rest of it, um. We're gonna oh yeah, no, up. this will catch up We've to us. We've used a lot of this session. The session. We're using up all our luck now. Atmosphere. Wait, you guys are using all your luck now. I had bad luck once, so the, the, this will this will one hundred percent catch up to us in the in the future. <laughs> <laughs> Or, or we'll we'll, we'll get that kill. thing where it's like when we're when we're not in combat we'll just get like the best rolls ever and the moment we get into combat where it's like ones twos <laughs> maybe a three. <laughs> See what happened to us? Oh, good luck. Where'd it go? <laughs> it went in the role play section. <laughs> yeah. Oh no. Um, but yeah, thank you guys. I had a really good time. I cannot wait for next week. And I will see you guys later. Mm. I gotta go to bed. Mm, good night. I need a call good my night. Boss for some reason. Good night. Good night. Good night. All right. And as for you guys, I will see you hopefully tomorrow. Um, tomorrow is the Tuesday art stream, as per usual. Um, Wednesday we're playing Mass Effect. Thursday I've got no streams planned. Um, I have to prep because my new roommate is moving in. Um. You will know them. That is Cyclonus. They are moving in with me. Um, so, <laughs> so I will see you guys tomorrow and Wednesday if you come out. I hope to see you then. And this will be up on my YouTube channel um, for arch archive purposes by the end of the night. So I love you lots. Hope you have a wonderful evening. Goodbye.